Welcome to the fantasy audiobook. Marvel. Reborn is a magic book, and you will get it back 10,000 times returns. Chapter 21. The Great Magicians of Kamar Taj, each one is extraordinary. Especially Modu, the Ancient One Disciple. No matter what his character is, whether he will rebel in the future, his strength cannot be faked. Even among the big magicians, he is one of the top ones. Even after seeing Bono's performance, he was still somewhat proud of himself. I don't believe this thing is really that perverted. Why is it so powerful? Modu thought in his heart. He was actually a little unhappy and a little jealous. He is a big magician. Among the entire Kamar Taj, there are few who are better than him. That mysterious magic book, why didn't he find it? Why, this is completely unreasonable. He was determined to try it out and prove his strength. Only, Modu's head was not broken, so he naturally knew that he was recognized by the magic book. It is different from ordinary magicians, their methods are very amazing. I was even more vigilant at the beginning. A red magic shield appeared in his hand. This is a shield made by mobilizing the great beings in the Marvel world, coupled with the support of the magician level soul power. The strength end is extremely powerful. Even if a missile explodes in front of him, he can still protect himself. Take action, let me see your strength. Let me see if the magic book is really that magical. Modu said in a deep voice. Facing a senior magician, it was naturally impossible for him to take action like this. That would make him look too ungraceful as a big magician. He looked at Bono quietly, waiting for him to take action. Big magician, then I'll be offended. Bono bowed his hand in respect. Next moment, he took action directly. Although Bono showed great respect just now, he was unambiguous when he started taking action. Buzz. There was a soft sound, and his legs turned golden. In this semi-elemental state, his speed has been greatly improved. With his legs strong, he shot out like a cheetah. The golden light flashed on the fist. He hit Modu's shield. As the saying goes, speed is power. When the speed really reaches the limit, even a needle can theoretically have the ability to destroy the planet. Bono's ability is definitely not that scary for the time being but it is definitely not to be underestimated, the speed is amazing. The power that explodes is definitely not comparable to that of ordinary senior magicians. Bang bang bang. In just a few seconds, Bono has already thrown hundreds of punches. Even with Modu's strength, he took a step back and almost lost his breath. Modu's complexion immediately turned ugly. He, he was forced to retreat by a senior magician. Still using such a simple trick, is the power given by the magic book really unmatched? This Bono is just an ordinary senior magician from Kamar Taj. Usually there is no sense of existence at all. He was the kind of person who would at least have a partial impression of Modu when he walked in front of him. This impression is also entirely due to the fact that, throughout Kamar Taj, there are not many magicians. Now, just by the chance of getting the magic book, this ordinary senior magician became so powerful. This is magic with the power of gods. It can weaken the attack by at least 50%. It actually has such power. Modu had various emotions in his heart, and his face was as heavy as water. He took two steps back and took a deep breath. That's how you want to deal with me. Not enough. I will also let you see my methods. Modu actually flicked his hand with one hand, and the magic shield in his hand dispersed. He picked up the staff stuck at his waist. With a tug of both hands, he pulled the staff into three sections, with dazzling yellow energy flashing in the middle of each section. Various sparks constantly fall from this staff. Hiss. The magician is serious about this. Fasa said worriedly. Luke was surprised next to him. Did Modu, the magician, not really take action before? That's natural. Don't underestimate our great magician in Kamar Taj if you have a few points of ability. Which of us Kamar Taj great magicians can't fight the demons of hell? If it were to explode with all its strength, it would be easy to destroy a small town. Use the staff to increase the power even more. Bono is in trouble. Fasa couldn't help but shake his head. What is a big magician? That is a powerful magician who has his own understanding of magic. Most of them have mastered more than a dozen powerful magics to control deity's power. At the same time, he also has his own unique path. Take out your weapons and bear the power that your physical body cannot bear. It means that Modu is coming. 
Next moment, Mo Du's eyes indeed became sharp. Bono knew something was wrong and attacked first. With the blessing of the shining fruit, its speed is extremely fast, but it is also a bit fierce. But Modu took a step back. Bono's kick directly touched his chest. It was only a few millimeters away from his body. Such precise distance control. It can be seen how accurate the combat intuition of this great magician is Mordo. Taking advantage of Bono's inability to exert any force. A light flashed in Modu's eyes, and he smashed the magic weapon in his hand forward. In his hand, the staff was like a three-section whip among traditional weapons. It can be used freely by poking, picking and tapping. Now he took advantage of Bono's inability to move due to body inertia and directly used all his strength. The staff struck directly from top to bottom with a rustling sound. Look at the astonishing speed, it is even more amazing than the firearm. If an ordinary person takes this blow, I'm afraid that not only will the bones be broken, but they will be directly exploded by this terrifying power. There is a limit to the force that flesh and blood can withstand. Even a magician would have to stay in bed for several months if he was hit head on. Such a vicious blow. Fasa and Luke, who were watching from the side, felt their hearts rising to their throats. Bono was not nervous at all. At the critical moment, the shining fruit ability activates. His thigh also directly emitted a dazzling golden light and instantly turned into a ball of light. The staff with extremely amazing power passed directly through the middle of the beam. Boom. The staff fell to the ground, and the marble slab more than half a meter thick exploded. A deep pit with a diameter of one meter appeared on the ground. The power of Modu's attack is evident. But, Modu did not feel complacent about the power of his attack, but instead looked ugly. Seeing Bono's body turned into light, Modu felt like cursing in his heart. This is a shame. The body becomes light directly. You're still being unreasonable. His magician's attack was unable to harm Bono at all. Several times throughout Kamartage, I am afraid that only today has such an outrageous thing happened. Good, good. Modu scolded her in his heart, but he still maintained his grace and praised her. His teeth were about to be broken. Kamartage, above the training ground. Modu, who was usually very calm, was now in a very bad mood. He did not expect that this so-called legendary magic book could not only give people abilities. So weird, he had only heard of this ability to turn the body into light. I heard that there are some superhero groups among ordinary people who, due to some accidents, have mastered special abilities. I didn't expect that this magic book could also give people this kind of ability. With this kind of ability, even his ordinary means are a bit helpless. But, being a big magician, he is naturally not comparable to ordinary magicians. If he were to use real means, Bono would die in his hands even if his whole body turned into light. It's not like he doesn't know how to attack directly on the soul. And it's what he's best at. Only, for ordinary senior magicians, this method is used. Even if Modu wins, he will probably be embarrassed. As a great magician, you not only have to win, but you also have to win with grace and understatement. This is also a sense of being trapped by fame. I didn't expect that the contents in the magic book are indeed somewhat mysterious. But I won't hold back anymore, so be careful. Modu said. Please give me some advice from the magician. Bono was also in a good mood. He just discovered that when fighting Modu, his mastery of the shining fruit was also improving rapidly. Don't look at it, it just seemed to be a short period of time. But facing the big magician, Bono didn't dare to be careless and concentrated. Instead, he gained some understanding of the shining fruit. I also have a deeper understanding of domineering. Hockey is a powerful force, not inferior to the power of magic. Even in a sense, domineering will be stronger. After all, even a magician of the sorcerer supreme level would still die if someone stabbed him. If your domineering habits are taken to the extreme, it will be completely different. Physical quality can be said to be inhuman. In order to fully utilize the effects of the shining fruit, one must practice hockey to a certain level. Because of this, he does not object to sparring with Modu. In my heart, I felt that Modu, the great magician, was indeed well-deserved and very impressive. While thinking in his mind, Bono used 100% of his energy to guard against Modu in front of him. Mordo saw Bono ready and not hesitation. With a wave of his hand, the cosmic energy suddenly burst out. 
A dazzling light appeared in his hands. The scarlet light continued to rotate, forming a scarlet magic light wheel in his hand. This light wheel looks like a chainsaw, spinning at high speed. Countless sparks kept falling from both sides, looking very impressive. Be careful, Modu reminded. Just wave your hand. The scarlet light wheel shot towards Bono. It's extremely fast and looks amazing. Only, after getting the shining fruit, Bono's ability may not be strong, but his life-saving ability is really amazing. There was a flash of golden light. He actually bent down in a moment. The elementalization that was originally only possible on the limbs spread directly to the waist. His whole body seemed to be like a rubber man, folding directly in half to avoid this shocking blow. Captain Mordu just snorted and waved his hand again. Just listen to a click. The scarlet light wheel of flight in the distance actually changed instantly, from one to two. Attacking Bono again. The tricky angle and perfect timing made Luke and Fasa next to him couldn't help but sigh at how powerful the magician was. Bono's expression suddenly changed. Good thing. Although he is lazy, he is also a senior magician, and he is not a freeloader. It responds very quickly. The elementalization process becomes very fast. The moment two light wheels passed by, his body also turned into golden light. Only then did he avoid the tragedy of being torn into pieces by this terrifying magic flywheel. Even so, he still felt a pain in his body. It seems that the light wheel can not only attack the physical body, but also attack him through the light. Bono's heart sank. This is not to say that the shining fruit is not powerful. But his practice is not yet at home. This is not a pure elementalization, but the body has completed a partial transformation, and theoretically it is still a body of flesh and blood. It's nothing to encounter ordinary magic. When encountering such a high-level powerful magic as Mordo, its shortcomings were immediately revealed. It seems we have to give it a try. I don't know if I can meet the big magician. A rare flash of fighting spirit appeared in Bono's heart. The man in front of me is one of the strongest magicians in Kamar Taj. Being able to fight to this level is enough to be proud of. But although Bono looks lazy and is frivolous about everything, he is still very persistent in his heart. At this critical moment, he made up his mind. Modu naturally didn't know what Bono was thinking. He felt a little proud now. What if there is no inheritance of magic books? He's such a big magician, can't he easily defeat this senior magician? This is the essence of magic. The magic book is indeed powerful, but rest completely suppresses him. Even if you can't see his ability, this magic book is nothing more than that. After thinking about it for a moment, Modu didn't reveal anything on the surface. Instead, he reminded me in a seemingly grand manner. Be careful, Mordo waved again, and two powerful halos of light sped towards Bono again. Bono saw two scarlet magic halo coming. There was a flash of light in his eyes. Whether you can pass or not depends on this move. He took a deep breath, and the ability of the shining fruit was fully mobilized by him. Clap your hands and pull your right hand outward. After doing this, a shining golden sword appeared in his hand. It's just that the golden light on this thin sword flickers, and it seems a bit unstable. Tian Kong Yun Sword Bono was filled with excitement, he actually used this powerful move. Only, with his current strength, he can't last long. Without any hesitation, holding the sword in both hands, he slashed directly at the two scarlet halos. Click, it was like glass falling to the ground and shattering into pieces. The two scarlet light wheels were instantly shattered by the energy structure being destroyed. The golden lightsaber in his hand also flickered and disappeared. Bono also looked a little pale. But his face was filled with joy. Fasa and Luke, who were watching from the side, were indeed shocked. Senior magician, crushing the magic of the great magician. What a joke. This is a big magician. There is a huge difference between them and the magician. Is the inheritance in the magic book really so perverted? The ability of a senior magician can actually break the magic of a big magician. Kamar Taj has never had a record of a senior magician being able to challenge a big magician. It appears now, able to break the magic of the great magician. You can kill the big magician. Fasa and Luke felt turbulent in their hearts. Modu also stood here, stunned for a moment. Modu really didn't expect it. How could a mere senior magician become so powerful? The magic of the great magician can be broken. This is almost impossible in Kamar Taj. 
The gap between a big magician and a senior magician is very big. Logically speaking, the big magician releases magic, and no matter how ordinary senior magician attacks, it is impossible to break through the defense. The big magician won't consume much, because the Kamar Taj magician fight relies on the energy in the universe. Their mental power is just a starter. Kamar Taj's magician casts spells, just like driving a car. Psychics are the keys, magic is the different cars. They also understand certain principles of automobiles, but they don't have to worry about it. So, the great magician has strong mental power, powerful natural mobilization power, and terrifying power of magic released. It's hard for a senior magician to come close. But now, his magic was easily broken by a senior magician. How amazing is this? Is the inheritance in the magic book really so perverted? Already able to go against common sense? Mo Du's expression was very ugly. Fortunately, the other three were also in shock and did not react much. Modu was able to adjust his mentality and put a smile on his face again. Okay, okay, this is where our discussion ends today. Bono, you really surprised me. Bono smiled sheepishly. I'm just playing tricks, and I'm far from a magician. Bono bowed his hand in a considerate manner. This made Modu feel better. This is not a trick, it is real strength. The power in the magic book is indeed extraordinary. It seems that I will try my luck in the future. Modu smiled and spoke. The remaining three could only laugh along. Your ability is indeed not weak, but you still need to practice hard. Combat experience can sometimes determine victory or defeat. If you rely on your ability and become arrogant, you are not far from death. Understand, after laughing for a while, Modu's face became serious again and he spoke. Thank you magician for your advice, I understand. Bono spoke. Um, in that case, go ahead. Have a good life and practice. Kamar Taj will still look to you in the future. Modu smiled and encouraged. The three magicians bowed and turned to leave. After the three people left, Modu's expression turned cold. He looks young. But now, he is already over 50 years old. He even lived through World War II. Compared to these young magicians, he is indeed considered an older generation. But precisely because of this, he felt a little unwilling. Why has he been practicing magic for so many years and is so good, yet he has not been recognized by the magic book? Are these magicians recognized so easily? This is not fair at all. Modu appears to be upright and very fair. But privately, he is often jealous of others and very ambitious. Now that he sees that others can obtain such powerful power without working hard, how can he find balance in his heart? This kind of thing made a trace of anger burn in his heart. But, with the existence of the great god Ancient One, he didn't dare to do anything too extreme. Among Kamar Taj, except for this magical book that suddenly appeared, he had never seen anything that could escape the eyes of the Ancient One. However, just because I can't do it doesn't mean others can. If you provoke certain people, then you don't blame me. A hint of coldness flashed in Modu's heart. Turn around and leave. This Ancient One disciple is not a good person. Kamar Taj was betrayed in this world, and in other parallel universes, the United Illuminati even eliminated Doctor Strange and took his place. After Doctor Strange from another universe went to ask for help, he even pretended to deceive him and then imprisoned him. Anyone who can do such a thing, no matter how righteous he is, is not a good person. Only, Mordo has always been very good, he just didn't show it. In the entire Kamar Taj, Caecilius, who is also a disciple of the Ancient One, is probably the only one who knows the true nature of Mordo. Caecilius was proud, ambitious and greedy for power, but he was very smart. And there is a reason why he covets the power of magic, which is completely different from Mordo. Naturally, he despised Modu in his heart. But after all, they were both disciples of the Ancient One, and Modu was still his senior brother. Even if Modu came, he wouldn't show any emotion. Modu, what's the matter? Caecilius asked very coldly. When Modu saw this, he didn't care. He just smiled and said. I came to talk to you about the magic book. You came to me to talk about the magic book. Didn't you think before that what the king told was a lie? The sarcasm on Caecilius's face was barely concealed. This guy Modu is really hypocritical. Modu didn't take this to heart. Of course it's because I saw another person get the opportunity today. 
I even tried it myself. The power is really extraordinary. Modu sighed and clicked his tongue in surprise. Although Caecilius knew that this guy Modu said this, he definitely didn't mean it well. It's just that Caecilius is arrogant and thinks that his ability Kamartage is the first. Just now, this magic book once again chose a disciple, but he was not chosen. It was indeed very unbearable in his heart. But he is still a magician after all, but there is nothing strange about him on his face. Not my business, Caecilius mocked. Modu knows this junior brother best. Even if he knew it was a trap, he would never be able to bear it. Such as the character of Caecilius. How can you say it has nothing to do with you? You are also a great magician of Kamartage, and you have such an outstanding disciple under your sect. Aren't you happy? Modo was still adding fuel to the fire. Ha ha, you don't have to provoke me. Others may not know your face, but don't I. Aren't you jealous of them? Wong, Luke, and the lucky guy you just mentioned, which one is better than us? Now they are getting gifts, don't you have any thoughts in your mind? If you weren't afraid of the Sorcerer Supreme, how could you be so honest? Caecilius naturally didn't know how to talk back, so he sneered. Oh, you misunderstood me too much. Since the words are not interesting, I'll take my leave. Modu shook his head, cupped his hands, and turned around to leave. As soon as he turned his head, his expression immediately became extremely gloomy. Caecilius looked at Mordo with a mocking look on his face. The nails on the palms of my hands are almost digging into the flesh. It's so enjoyable, so enjoyable. I didn't expect that these two guys are really not fuel efficient. The Ancient One really doesn't know how to teach his disciples. I have three apprentices, all of them are troublemakers. Lin Yu, who was watching secretly, was amazed. The Ancient One had three apprentices, two betrayed Kamar Taj, and one, Doctor Strange, was the troublemaker. The first two were just to deal with Kamar Taj, but the last one actually almost destroyed the entire world for little Spider-Man, giving people around the world clear memories. Simply outrageous. In terms of strength, he may not be as good as the Ancient One now. But when it comes to accepting disciples, Ancient One still has issues to discuss with him. What happened to the two great magicians of Kamar Taj? Most magicians don't know. For ordinary magicians, big magicians are superior and different from them. Luke is one of them. People who can be recognized by magic books are naturally different from ordinary people. Even if it doesn't have enough ability, it still has its own unique characteristics. Luke is a very unique existence. Because of his childhood experience, he admired superheroes very much and wanted to become a superhero. Under the influence of this source of power, he works very hard. It is human nature to enjoy freely. If you want to suppress this nature, you need a stronger desire. Coincidentally, Luke's desire to become a superhero is strong. Naturally, he worked hard. Especially after seeing Bono's strength, Luke worked even harder. I'm not strong enough. You can only fight senior magicians, why should you be a superhero? I have to work harder. The Navy Six type is so extraordinary, and there is still more potential to be tapped. Luke was excited. He naturally knows that there are strong and weak magic in this world. There is naturally a considerable gap between ordinary magic and magic that borrows the powerful existence between heaven and earth. Although the power in the magic book is extraordinary, there must be some differences. It is normal for there to be a gap between the sixth marine style he mastered and the so-called shining fruit. Only, he just wants you to bring out the full power of the sixth marine style, and that's his problem. The sixth marine style is a purely physical training technique. I have to work harder. Luke thought in his mind. Navy six is different from magic. It is a technique to hone the body, temper the will, and make the body exceed the upper limit of ordinary humans. It can be said that it is an effort and a reward. If you are lucky enough, you will be able to comprehend the power called domineering in these six naval styles. After seeing Bono's power, Luke was even more determined to work hard. Now, Luke continued to practice in the training ground. His muscles were bulging and bulging. There was a pool of human-shaped water stains underneath him, which was the sweat flowing from his body. The blood in his body flows at high speed, and his muscles become as hard as steel. This is the way to use iron blocks in the sixth naval style. It is also a great way to exercise. Under this situation, Luke could feel that his body was slowly changing. 
his body seemed to be slowly changing in its most essential parts. In fact, he could already perceive this change a few days ago. It's just not as clear as it is now. I feel it now. Limit. As long as I break through this limit, I can perceive that kind of power. Luke felt excited. His will and spirit were refined together, and what was originally just an idle force has now become a force. What Luke doesn't know is that the power he is now exposed to is domineering. Domination is the innate power of human beings, and everyone has this power. Momentum, murderous intent, fighting spirit, persistence and other things related to will are all external manifestations of domineering. Unfortunately, this power is beyond the reach of most people. Only a very few people have the ability to seize that part of the opportunity to control this power of will called domineering. Luke is this kind of person. Definitely, his ability to master this power was inseparable from the help of the sixth form of the navy given to him by Lin Yu. The sixth marine style is actually a taijutsu modeled after hockey, which can give people the power to defeat those with devil fruit ability. But as its essence, it is still an imitation of domineering. Luke has practiced the power of the sixth form of the navy to the extreme that his current body can bear. And the navy six styles given by Lin Yu through the system are naturally extraordinary. Sensing Luke's will, the sixth marine style directly merged it into one, mastering the power of hockey. Phew, there was a soft sound. Luke felt as if a barrier had been pierced in his body. His whole body became relaxed. There seemed to be a layer of invisible power wrapped around his body, making his body feel as if he was in a hot spring, very comfortable. Luke stood up slowly, with a dazed expression on his face. Is this domineering, the power of the human will and spirit? Luke held out his hand. An invisible stream of light flickered, gradually covering his fingertips with a translucent black film. It seems a bit weak, but it is solid. All the hard work pays off, I finally mastered the domineering power. Luke said in an extremely excited mood. Is this kind of power originally called domineering? At this time a voice sounded in his ear. Luke was startled and turned his head suddenly. But found out. Behind him was no one else. It is the king. However, he didn't notice at all when the king arrived. To know, the six naval postures given by the training system make his body's five senses very sharp. After understanding domineering, he improved to a higher level. In this way, the king's existence was not discovered. How strong is this great magician? As expected, I gained the power of the magic book, and my strength is truly unfathomable. Luke was shocked and quickly saluted. See the great magician. No need to be polite. Wang waved his hand. It seems you just gained something. There was some curiosity in Wang's eyes. He still valued this junior who also understood the power of the magic book. Because he knows how incredible the inheritance in the magic book is. Yes magician, I gained something. Luke nodded. Can you show it to me? What's so special about this so-called domination? Wong asked. Luke thought for a moment and then spoke. Definitely. As he spoke, he began to control the domineering energy in his body. Slowly and constantly the domineering energy emanated from his body, forming a black film on the surface of his body. It looks like he is wearing a layer of armor. Is this domineering? It's quite mysterious. It seems like it can make your body strong and indestructible, right? The king took one look and saw the truth. The great magician is truly a god. Luke said respectfully. Wong smiled bitterly and shook his head. What kind of god is he? This magic book is really a god. This so-called domineering power and the flowing rock shattering fist he mastered are not the same system at all. But it is also extremely powerful and has amazing potential. He could tell. This seemingly weak membrane can increase its body strength by several levels. And the king could see that these powers did not come out of thin air, but came from Luke's will. This way of using power is really ingenious. Indescribably wonderful. Magic books are incredible. Wong was not surprised that Luke was able to grow. Maybe he didn't pay attention to this little magician before. But after the magician assessment, he became interested in this child. Always observe Luke's every move. He also had some understanding of Luke's character. This kid is very determined and has a kind heart. Maybe the original Luke didn't have outstanding magic ability, and he might be ignored by everyone. It's just that it's completely different now. He received the inheritance of the magic book and gained incomparable magical power. 
constantly making progress. In just one month, he once again realized this power called domineering. The strength is truly increasing. This made Wang couldn't help but sigh. The magic book's methods were really amazing and a bit unimaginable. I didn't expect that you have made such great progress during this period of time. It seems we all misjudged you before. The power provided by this magic book really has no upper limit. Wong said with emotion. This is necessary. Compared to you and Bono, I am, my progress is not worth mentioning. Luke scratched his head and said. He meant what he said. It can be seen that deep down he thinks so. Whether it's the shining fruit mastered by Bono or the mysterious boxing technique mastered by Wong, their power is amazing. On the contrary, the sixth marine style he mastered seemed a bit ordinary. He certainly has no pride in this. Why belittle yourself? You are not that weak yourself, and the inheritance of the magic book is also very powerful. Give you enough time and you will grow. Bono and I have practiced for so many more years than you, if you can be better than us. Then what's the point of practicing for so many years? Wong said with a smile. It has been decades since he entered the realm of magic. Even though he now has a stronger way of practice, he cannot deny his previous years of practice. If it weren't for his hard work many years ago, how could he be so strong now? Luke is already very good with his current strength. It can only be said that the magic book is really perverted. Thinking of this, Wong shook his head. Luke, you have to remember that on the road to cultivation, you just need to move forward firmly and don't belittle yourself. The skills and domineering power you have mastered are already very powerful. It's just that I still lack some practical experience. I can't help you in other aspects, but I can give you some advice in this aspect. Wong said. Luke's eyes lit up. This is to give him personal guidance. He has fought with senior magicians before, and has also seen senior magicians fight against big magicians. But he has never officially taken action against the magician. There seems to be a chance today. Thank you magician for your advice. Luke said excitedly. You're quite smart, kid. Come on, let me see what's so special about your dominance. Wong said with a smile. That's offending. Luke didn't have any hesitation and just backed away. After bowing, Luke's eyes became sharp. A strong will emerges. His body was surrounded by a circle of black domineering energy. Razor, Luke stomped on the ground, and something exploded beneath his feet. Luke rushed out in a strange trajectory. I saw him constantly changing directions in the air, and the air around him was pounding with his steps. White air burst out constantly, leaving traces on the ground. Wang's eyes lit up. What a powerful move. The physical force directly compresses the air, which is really powerful. This kind of power has exceeded the limits of human beings. However, it's still a little bit close to dealing with me. Wang smiled. His hands flashed. Silvery white light appeared on his hands. Luke was already approaching the king. He raised his foot and kicked him. His skin was covered with a layer of black light, and he kicked up with astonishing force. Boom. There was a muffled sound. Fists and kicks exchanged. Wong actually felt that his hands were a little numb. This was because Luke's strength was too strong, causing his hands to shake. What a powerful force. The king was shocked. This kind of power is no weaker than an ordinary magician. How terrible. This guy was just a newbie magician before. Its strength is completely different from that of the great magician, and there is a gap that is completely impossible to cross. Now, with the ability given by the magic book, I have overcome this impossible distance. Luke's combat power is already comparable to that of a magician. If it were magic, it would probably take decades to do it. How perverted is the power given by the magic book? Wong took a deep breath and suppressed the distracting thoughts in his heart. Well done. Wong resisted Luke's blow and pushed hard. Luke flew out completely. Luke turned over touched the ground with his hands, and rubbed for dozens of meters before stopping. Luke looked solemn. He is truly a magician. So strong. He had already used 80% of his strength in this attack, but it was unable to deal with the powerful magician's hands. How strong is the king? As expected of someone who has obtained the power of a magic book. It seems that he is going to use all his strength. After mastering hockey, Luke finally gained some confidence. Navy 6 seems to have only 6 moves. But in fact, there are quite a few variations. Many strong people have integrated the characteristics of their own practice to use these tricks. 
And these tricks all exist in Luke's mind. As his strength and physical strength improve, the seal is gradually lifted. After mastering domineering, he can also perform some powerful moves without worrying about being seriously injured. Big magician, be careful, I'm going to be serious. Luke even gave a reminder. Good, come on, let me see how good our rising stars at Kamar Taj are. A smile appeared on Wang's serious face. Luke's eyes were sharp. Boom, push your legs hard, he jumped up and flew directly into the air. If an ordinary person reaches midair and has nowhere to borrow strength, he will soon fall to the ground. But Luke is different. Under the influence of his extremely powerful force, he actually moved in midair. The body suddenly spun. Luke's speed was so amazing that he seemed to have turned into a tornado. Shave. Iron. Luke's voice sounded. The black rotating figure looked like an electric drill. It fell directly from the sky and headed towards the king. The astonishing speed created an astonishing vortex in the surrounding air. The white air flow continued to rotate with his body. It looks very powerful. Good means. The body is so strong. The magic book is incredible. Wong was slightly surprised. To do this, you not only need terrifying power, but also incredible physical strength. Such a short time. Raise your physical fitness to such a terrifying level. The inheritance in the magic book is really incredible. Buzz. In the sky, black iron blocks seemed to be spinning continuously, making an astonishing sound. At the bottom tip, a sharp force is constantly forming. This power is not like magic, it mobilizes the energy in the universe. Rather, it is purely caused by powerful force. In the blink of an eye, the drill bit transformed by Luke fell from the sky and drilled towards the king. An inexplicable attraction emerges. Wong suddenly found that it was very difficult for him to avoid. That wonderful gravitational pull made it impossible for him to avoid it. Luke, you are still too young. This little power can't stop me. Besides, why should I hide? Wang's lips curled up. Silvery white light appeared in his hands. Other than that, there's nothing special about it at all. Just like this, Wang directly hit Luke who landed in the sky with both hands. Phew, the two come into contact. White smoke rose directly. The palms of Luke and Wang, who were spinning at high speed, met. The two magics directly produced incredibly high temperatures. Only, however, Wang's hands did not change at all, as if he did not feel the astonishing high temperature at all. After a while, Luke's immediate follow-up was powerless, and Wang grabbed his legs with both hands and threw him away. Luke, who landed on the ground, suddenly widened his eyes and looked at Wang. What a terrifying body! He originally thought that after practicing the sixth form of the navy and mastering the domineering power, his physical strength would be terrifying enough. But in front of the king, all this seems to be nothing. Wong blocked his easily. As expected, they both received the inheritance of the magic book. It's really scary. The other big magicians in Kamar Taj don't have such means. Such a powerful body should not be possessed by a magician at all. Big magician is indeed powerful. I still need to learn. Luke thought in his mind. But it was precisely because of this that he became excited. Whether it is the sixth form of the Marines or hockey, they are both spring promotions fighting methods. Only by fighting will you become stronger. If he finally met Wong, he couldn't give up such a good opportunity. Magician, I have one more trick. Luke said, feel free to use it. The move you just made is powerful, but it also has flaws. If we were against an equal opponent, if you flew into the sky, you would be exposing your own weaknesses. As long as you have a little remote means, you will definitely suffer. Let's see if your new tricks make any progress. Wong said with a smile. Thank you magician for your advice. But my point is not that simple. Luke also said excitedly. The domineering force once again formed a black film under his boss Sao. The domineering power continuously enhances his physical strength. It also gave Luke the confidence. Moonstep. Luke's figure flashed. Relying on powerful strength, Luke constantly changes direction. Next moment, Luke was already close to Wang's side. Point gun, Huang Lian, Luke shouted. Luke mobilized all his domineering energy and concentrated it on his index finger. Ding, ding, ding. The attack was like raindrops, hitting the king's body directly. High-frequency attacks, combined with his extremely hard index finger. 
It exerted unimaginable power. The finger gun is the most powerful attack among the six naval styles. With its extremely hard index finger, it can instantly burst out with a force 10,000 times more powerful than a firearm. No matter can resist this power. Definitely. This also requires strong physical support. Otherwise, without attacking others, one's own fingers would be broken first. Luke only dared to use this trick because he had mastered domineering. Launch hundreds of attacks instantly. The enemy standing in front of you should be riddled with holes. Only. The king is different. His body is like the hardest steel in the world. When he hit it with his finger gun, it just made a tinkling sound, like gold and iron intersecting. The king was defenseless. His attacks couldn't break through the defense at all. The attack, which could easily penetrate steel, failed to leave any trace on Wang's body. See this. Luke could only smile bitterly. The body of the king. It's much more exaggerated than his magic. He now suspected that even Kamar Taja's most powerful magic, Basat's thunder, might not be able to do anything to the king. Even if the king is standing there. Feeling that all his domineering energy had been exhausted, Luke could only stop. Great magician, your body. There's really nothing I can do. Luke said a little frustrated. Wong also didn't take it seriously and lightly brushed his clothes. Don't be frustrated, your attack is not weak. If the big magician is unprepared and attacked by you in this way, it will definitely be unstoppable. I'm just a special case. Wong comforted, if it weren't for the blessing given to him by the magic book. He didn't dare to be so careless. If it were him before, he would not dare to use his body to resist such an attack. This attack doesn't look very destructive. But speaking of penetration, it's extremely amazing. Even the big magician's body can't resist it. I'm afraid even an ordinary magic shield can be broken. It's really scary. It is really hard for the royal family to imagine that Luke, a young man who has been in the industry for less than a year. Can you have such amazing strength in such a short time? Does it depend on ability? Wong thinks not. He felt that it was not ability that determined all this, but the magic book. It is the power in the magic book that makes them so powerful. The magic book is probably a legendary divine thing. Only the beings in Anxi's ancient legends can have such power. Wong couldn't help but think in his heart. Shaking his head, Wong gathered his thoughts. Luke, don't be depressed. In terms of combat prowess alone, you're probably at the level of a great magician. I'm afraid none of the big magicians guarding the grand ceremony are your match. That's amazing enough. Keep up the good work and your future will be unimaginable. Wong opened his mouth to encourage. Thank you magician, I will try my best. Luke also spoke excitedly. I feel very excited. Among Kamar Taj, there is another person who is very excited. This person is none other than Lin Yu who is watching all this secretly. I didn't expect that this kid would be so strong after not seeing him for a few days. And I also realized domineering. Tisk, tisk, the system is too awesome. It can be called a life-changing change against the will of heaven. Lin Yu couldn't help but sigh. In the original world, few Kamar Taj existed. Ordinary magician is basically a background board, used to show other people's strength. All kinds of people were killed in one move. That is, Modu and Wong, a few of them showed their strength a little bit. It's different now. Luke, a little boy who has just started practicing for a short time, has such strength. System. It is not an exaggeration to say that it is a change of fate that defies fate. On the training ground, Wong kept giving Luke pointers. Each move uses the methods rewarded by the magic book. Lin Yu also focused on these two people. Over Kamar Taj, unknown changes occurred. It's like the TV signal is suddenly bad. The sky stuck in the noodle machine suddenly became a little intermittent, as if the picture was delayed. The clouds in the sky are constantly flashing. This strange scene lasted for about dozens of minutes. The weird thing is, no one noticed this surprising scene. Even the big magicians are blind to everything above their heads. The strange changes gradually disappeared. The emergence of golden sparks. A golden circular portal appeared out of thin air. A bald woman wearing a robe walked out of the portal. It's obviously a very weird hairstyle, but it doesn't seem to be out of place at all on this woman. Not only that, this man still seems to have extraordinary bearing. There is a peculiar temperament. Her eyes were extremely profound. Although she looks like she is around 30 or 40 years old at most, 
her eyes are full of vicissitudes and traces of time. She walked out of the portal and walked towards the main hall. Magicians who saw her on the road bowed and saluted, with extremely respectful expressions on their faces. Under the admiration of everyone, the woman walked into the hall with ease. Now, Modu was handling matters in the main hall. Modu was shocked when he saw the person coming, and immediately stood up and bowed to salute. Sorcerer Supreme, Modu was respectful and did not dare to be disrespectful at all. This person is no one else. It is the protector of Kamar Taj, the most powerful magician on earth. Sorcerer Supreme, Ancient One. Just looking at Modu's respectful attitude, you can see how amazing the Ancient One's prestige is. When did it happen? Ancient One looked at Mordo. Her eyes full of vicissitudes of life seem to be able to see through people's hearts, and nothing can be hidden from her eyes. Modu's heart twitched and his expression changed. It took him a moment to calm down. Something big really happened in Kamar Taj. But now it seems like it's a good thing. Modu said. What good thing? Tell me what you're saying. Ancient One said with a smile on his face. Although he is the Sorcerer Supreme, the nature of Ancient One is not as serious as it seems. In fact, although she looks young, she is hundreds of years old and looks more like an old naughty child. Often joking with magicians, he is also quite gentle in his treatment of magicians. Modu was nervous because he had something evil in his heart. For the Sorcerer Supreme, this is it. A mysterious presence suddenly appeared among us Kamar Taj. It is said that it is a magic book that can give people mysterious knowledge. Three magicians have received gifts. Mordo explained to the Ancient One. After the panic just now, he had regained his composure, and the Ancient One didn't even notice that something was mysteriously wrong. Instead, after hearing Mo Du's words, he couldn't help but squeeze the fan in his hand. Is it the method of the devil from hell? Ancient One spoke. Even Kamar Taj is not infallible. Many powerful beings in purgatory have means to project their power to the earth. Encountered this kind of thing. The first thing Ancient One thought of was those guys in hell who couldn't see the light. Probably not. I don't think those guys in hell have such means. Modu said. He has also seen the world. He even faced Mephisto head on. Is the magic book comparable to the Mephistas from hell? If they really had such means, I'm afraid Kamar Taj would have been breached by them long ago. How could it be possible to suppress them and fight for so many years? Hearing Modu say this, Ancient One showed a hint of surprise. It's not their method. Interesting. Ancient One believed in Modu's vision. Those Mephistas in hell don't have the strength to fool a big magician. It would be very interesting if this so-called magic book was not the means of those in hell. Let's go and have a look. Ancient One slapped the small fan in his hand and said. I didn't expect that I would encounter such interesting things just after returning from the deep dimension. Before leaving, there was no such magic book in the future predicted by Ancient One. Interesting, really interesting. After taking Modu out of the hall, Ancient One went to the training ground without any care. As expected, Wong instructs Luke on the training ground. When Modu saw this scene, his pupils shrank slightly. The Ancient One is too powerful. The ability of the Prophet is indeed terrifying. He didn't say anything to Ancient One, but she came here on her own. Even though he had known it for a long time, Modu still felt very excited. How long did it take for them to acquire so-called knowledge? Ancient One looked at Wong and Luke on the field with inexplicable eyes. A month at most, Modu twitched the corner of his mouth and said. In less than a month, Luke, this kid, had such means. This, magician is so scary, why isn't he recognized by the grimoire? Modu's heart was filled with envy, jealousy and hatred. Even Ancient One was a little surprised. In less than a month, the strength has improved so much. Kamar Taj's magic can't do that. What on earth is this so-called magic book? Ancient One felt a little more interested. Ancient One knows a lot about this world, and naturally knows that there are many unimaginable things in this world. Some beings can even destroy the entire multi-universe with a single thought. But she has never heard of anyone who can pass on such terrifying knowledge. Let's go, there's no need to look further. Zhong Zheng and peace come from the heart. It's not evil. Ancient One spoke. Hearing this, Modu became even more envious. Tell me, where did this magic book appear? Ancient One asked as he walked. 
reporting to the Sorcerer Supreme, this magic book appears in the library. Luke's knowledge was passed down from the beginning. Caecilius and I searched but found nothing, Modu said respectfully. The Ancient One's eyes flashed with surprise. Mordo and Caecilius couldn't find it. It's actually quite interesting. According to this, it is indeed somewhat mysterious. Let's go take a look. Ancient One clapped the fan in his hand, becoming even more interested. She wanted to see if this so-called mysterious magic book could deceive her. Taking Modu with them, the two of them entered the library. Seeing this place is like a vegetable market, very lively and full of magicians. Ancient One glanced at Modu. Sorcerer Supreme, everyone wants to come here to find opportunities. Modu wiped the sweat from his forehead and said. When Ancient One heard what he said, he shook his head and shifted his gaze. Ancient One's spiritual power spreads out. The entire library is covered in the blink of an eye. Then a trace of surprise flashed in her eyes. She didn't find anything. In the library, Ancient One's eyes were full of surprise. You know, this library was built by her. Among them, most of the books were collected by her. What books there are, Ancient One is clear. She had no impression of this mysterious magic book at all. More importantly, she didn't find anything wrong at all in the library. The Ancient One knows, she is not the strongest in this world. Even if you count the powerful beings hidden in this world, her strength is not ranked at all. But, in the dimensional space around the earth, Ancient One feels that his strength is quite acceptable. Only, with her great strength, she didn't find anything here. Even when I was spying on my fate, I never found anything amiss. This, Ancient One's expression also became serious. Modo, are you sure that the so-called mysterious magic book really appears in the library? Ancient One asked, Sorcerer Supreme, of course I am sure. We Kamar Taj already have three magician certificates. Not to mention the king said so. Modu said honestly. In front of the Ancient One, he didn't dare to have any small thoughts. You can only tell the truth. The Ancient One nodded and said nothing. Wong is the most honest and honest among the magicians. Since he said it, he certainly wouldn't lie. And he also saw the power Wong held. That is completely different from the power of the Kamar Taj system, but it cannot be faked. Besides Wang and Luke, who else is there? Ancient One thought for a while and asked. The great magician is the senior magician Bono. Modu spoke. Let's go and have a look. The Ancient One also has no hesitation. Just wave your hand. The space in front of him shattered like a kaleidoscope. This is nothing else. It is one of the most powerful space magics in the entire Kamar Taj, the mirror dimension. The mirror dimension is a reflection of the real world. In addition to being used for combat and never interfering with the real world, it can also be used for surveillance. Unless one can see through two spaces at a glance, no one will be able to detect it. The Ancient One takes Mordo through the mirror dimension. Soon we arrived at the training ground. On the training ground, Bono is sparring with Fasa. He only slightly used the ability of the Shining Fruit, and Fasa was no match for him. The golden light is constantly flashing. Fasa was almost being pressed down and beaten. It is said that this is an ability called the Shining Fruit. Able to turn the body into light. It's outrageous. Mordo couldn't help but complain in front of the Ancient One. This shows how deeply impressed he is by the ability of the Shining Fruit. Element the duplication body and then reorganize it. Ability close to law level. Kind of like some superhero powers. Ancient One's eyes flashed with surprise. She knows that this world has this kind of ability. There are many superheroes who all have similar abilities to elementalize their bodies. But, they are all because of various accidents. Bono is different. He was designated by the grimoire to be granted this ability. This is completely different. And, Ancient One can see that Bono masters more than just this elemental ability. There is an even more magical power. It is a powerful force displayed by human will. Another completely different path from Kamar Taj. What is the origin of this magic book? How is it possible to offer so many mysteries? Ancient One thinks he is also familiar with ancient and modern times. She has even seen the legendary Book of Darkness of Hades and the Book of Emperor Wyshan of the Great Emperor Wyshan. There are few mysteries in this world that she doesn't know. But now Ancient One has no idea where this so-called magic book came from. There was a little surprise in my heart. 
Ancient One spoke. Let's go. You can't see anything. Their power is completely instilled, just a seed. No one else can learn that. Modu was horrified, thinking that the Ancient One had something to say. He had indeed had the idea of these magicians before. Later, because of fear of Ancient One, he still didn't take any action. Now it seems he did the right thing. Sorcerer Supreme, where are we going? Library, I want to see if I can find this so-called magic book. Ancient One spoke. She could now confirm that this magical magic book had no malicious intent. It's just that she is very interested in magic books now. She decided to check first to see if she could find anything unusual. If she couldn't find it, she would use the time gem. Came to the library again. The Ancient One emerged from the mirror space. The magicians surrounding Peng Jiwan have long since disappeared without a trace. Ancient One's terrifying mental power spread out, searching the library inch by inch. The terrifying mental fluctuations even distorted the real space, producing ripples visible to the naked eye. Call, the Ancient One took a deep breath. Sorcerer Supreme, what did you find? Modu asked from the side. Nothing was found. Ancient One spoke. You didn't even notice. Modu was shocked. The Ancient One couldn't even discover the origin of this magic book. That's the Sorcerer Supreme. The most powerful magician on Earth didn't even notice. The origin of this magic book is simply terrifying. It doesn't matter. Ancient One waved his hand calmly. A wave. A bronze eye appeared in her hand. Pinch with both hands. Light green light and a magic circle appeared. Scenes from the past appeared in Ancient One's eyes, and time seemed to flow backwards in her eyes. By time gem, the Ancient One saw scenes from the past, scenes where magicians gained ability. Only, she didn't see the so-called magic book, but the magicians she saw stayed where they were and were lost in thought. Then you get the magical ability. It was as if they all had hallucinations and then gained abilities out of thin air. Time cannot record its figure, what on earth is this? There was a flash of shock in Ancient One's eyes. As the Sorcerer Supreme, she had forgotten the last time she was so shocked. What exactly is this so-called mysterious magic book? Why can it possess such incredible power? The system is really awesome. Not even the Ancient One can find it. The Ancient One and Mordo were constantly shocked. Lin Yu was also constantly shocked. He was quite worried when he saw the Ancient One coming, for fear of being discovered. Ancient One and Time Gem have all been taken out. But what he didn't expect was. The Ancient One seems completely unaware of the magic book. Not only that. Even the Ancient One doesn't seem to be aware of his mysterious observation ability. Lin Yu could only say. The system is really awesome. In the library, the two Kamar Taj executives were shocked. With the strength of the two of them, they didn't find any trace of this so-called magic book. It's really unimaginable. What is the origin of this mysterious magic book that suddenly appeared? Modu was stunned and shocked for a long time. Then he couldn't help but ask. Sorcerer Supreme, this magic book has an unknown origin. Could it be the legendary divine thing? In ancient times, the earth was not so peaceful. Before humans existed, the ancient gods have already ruled the world. Humanity was created in the image of the ancient gods. It was only because of some reason that the ancient gods left the earth and the earth became the home of mankind. But there are still many traces of the ancient gods on the earth. Ancient god, being able to possess this kind of power is much stronger than the ancient gods. Ancient one shook his head. It can prevent her from discovering it. Is this something that ordinary ancient gods can do? I am afraid that only the legendary great beings in the level universe who have mastered everything can have this kind of power. Okay, don't think about this. Now it seems that the appearance of this magic book is not a bad thing. It's beneficial and harmless to our noodle machine. But it's better to make sure. Go to the king and ask him. Ancient One said softly, but his voice was unmistakable. With Mordo, Ancient One once again came to the training ground where Wang and Luke had fought before. Only, at the moment, Wang is the only one left here. He was boxing on the field. It looks a bit like Tai Chi practiced by old ladies in the park. But looking at the terrifying aura emanating around him, you know that this boxing technique is not as simple as it seems. The Ancient One just showed up with Mordo. The king had already discovered these two people. Seeing the Ancient One taking the lead, Wang quickly bent down and saluted. 
Sorcerer Supreme. In Kamar Taj lower level magicians do bow to high level magicians. However, most of them bowed their hands to show respect, and there was no strict hierarchy. Bowing down to salute is the highest etiquette only for the Sorcerer Supreme. Long time no see, no need to be so polite, King. Ancient One spoke gently. At this time, Wang stood up straight and gave Mo Du a look behind him. I want him to explain what's going on. Why did Sorcerer Supreme suddenly come back? But Mo Du didn't know how to speak. Just pretend you didn't see it at all. Wang could only ask. When did you come back? Just came back. But just after I came back, I heard that you had caused a big trouble. There was a mysterious light shining in Ancient One's eyes. Wang felt as if he had been seen through, and all the secrets were hidden in front of the Sorcerer Supreme. What a strong physical condition. After watching for a while, Ancient One spoke in surprise. Ancient One reached out and patted Wang's shoulder gently. Boom, there was a muffled sound on the ground. Wang's whole body fell directly into the ground. Kamar Taja's solid training ground seemed to be like a bubble, destroyed without any resistance. But Wang didn't seem to notice at all, and no one seemed to feel any discomfort at all. Modu watched from the side, and his pupils suddenly shrank. The Ancient One is Kamar Taja's most powerful magician. It is also the most powerful being in the entire Kamar Taj body. With her strong physical fitness, she can even wrestle with the Abyss Demonic Dragon. This kind of power didn't cause the king any feeling. Even if Ancient One stopped, this is too exaggerated. I haven't seen you in a few months. Your strength has improved a lot. Ancient One said with a smile. I was about to report to you. The king didn't care and walked out from the underground. The stones reinforced by magic were like soft plaster in front of him, turning into powder easily. When he came out, he faced the Ancient One respectfully. He told Ancient One the information he knew. The Chosen One, dealing with disaster. Interesting. Ancient One looked at Wang. Do you think she made a mistake when she chose magician? Why did you choose such a simple and honest guy? Do you believe what people say? This content sounds very unreliable. But although the content sounded like made up lies, she had no way to refute it. That magic book has asked for nothing so far. The power given is also righteous and peaceful, and it is the power of decency. This makes Ancient One a little confused about the purpose of this thing. She has lived for hundreds of years and has never seen anything so strange. Do saints really exist in this world? Even she would not do such a good thing. So what is the purpose of this magic book? The more I think about Ancient One, the more I feel something is wrong. Having fought with Mephista for hundreds of years, the more pie in the sky things happen to her, the more wary she becomes. Not to mention, this pie is so delicious and the reward is more powerful than magic. You have to prove it before you can feel at ease. Well, let's discuss it with Modu. Let me see what kind of power you have. If something is wrong, it can be discovered in time. Ancient One finally made up his mind and spoke. It's the Sorcerer Supreme. The King is perfectly fine with this. To be honest. He has been feeling a little guilty recently. Nothing else. The power awarded to him by the magic book is really too strong. In just one month, his strength improved by leaps and bounds. It's even doubled compared to before. And there is no feeling of hitting the upper limit at all. This is equivalent to if you are walking on the street and someone suddenly gives you hundreds of millions of soft girl coins, you will feel panic and doubt the origin of the money. This is what Wang is going through right now. What the Ancient One said was exactly what he meant. If even Ancient One couldn't see anything, he could practice with peace of mind. Modo, excuse me, mirror space. Wang bowed his hand to Modu. That's fine, I just want to see how much progress you have made. I'm very envious of the ability you have. Modu also smiled cheerfully and spoke. No one knows what's going on inside. Say it. The three of them opened the mirror dimension directly in front of them and entered it. They don't know. Their conversation all fell into the eyes of Lin Yu, who was secretly watching. Ancient One, the Sorcerer Supreme, is back, and Lin Yu naturally cannot let her act. This one is really too strong. Even after receiving multiple power returns, Lin Yu feels that he is still no match for Ancient One, not to mention that he has no human form and cannot display his powerful power. Fortunately, the system is powerful and provides mysterious power that the Ancient One cannot detect. 
he just happened to keep a good watch. Seeing the inner tube of the three people talking, Lin Yu just smiled. It seems you still doubt me again. But this is normal. It's normal to be suspicious, but it's a pity that you can't see it at all. In the end, you can only work for me honestly. Lin Yu was in a happy mood. In the eyes of others, his giving away his strength for free is simply a form of charity. Only he knows. The power he gives out will come back ten thousandfold when the time comes. There is no better sound in the world. This is the information gap. Even a wise man like Ancient One cannot see through. There is a gap in combat effectiveness between Kamar Taj magician. Even a big magician is the same. But, as they are both great magicians, they are naturally aware of the battle. Like Mordo, the magic he masters is used to deal with people. Naturally, he became the strongest among the great magicians. He also has his own pride. This time I just had this opportunity, and Modu just wanted to vent his unhappiness. His figure was as fast as lightning, completely different from ordinary magic spells. He grabbed a spell and rushed forward. Just for the king. This movement is neither painful nor itchy, and it even seems to be in slow motion. He just turned to one side and stretched out his hand. He actually grabbed Wang's hand that dropped from the sky. And under the influence of Wang's terrifying power, Modu's gesture did not move at all. This power, the Ancient One was watching the battle, a flash of surprise in his eyes. Mordo's power is not ordinary. Compared with ordinary people, although the physical body of a great magician is not that exaggerated, it still has a certain intensity. The strength is also extraordinary. In the king's hands he is like a child. Wang's method of training the body is much stronger than Kamar Taja's. Ancient one side. Wang also let go of Modu. There's no need to test, just take it seriously. I fought with Kaecilius before, it's not like you didn't see it. Wang said honestly. Modu's eyes darkened. Looking at the somewhat blue arms, I felt a little shocked. This guy, it seems to be getting stronger again. When fighting Kaecilius before, this body was definitely not so powerful. Now that you say so, I won't be polite. Modu had already thought of being rude and said it directly. Then, he took two steps back, and the white gold light flashed in his hand, and a shining blade appeared directly. The sacred sword of Emperor Weishan. Be careful. Modu spoke. Without saying a word, he just waved his hand and came on. In order to avoid being blocked by the king again, he directly more than doubled the length of the magic. It looks like he is holding a spear and fighting with the king. You should have seen it last time. This magic is useless to me. Wong rushed up without any hesitation. His hands were flashing with silvery white light, as if he didn't care about the sacred sword of Emperor Weishan. Hum, you think I'm like Kaecilius. Modu's skill is like splitting Washan Mountain with one force. Huge white gold weapons, carrying blazing heat, fell from the sky. Since Weishan Emperor can become Kamar Taja's strongest offensive magic, it is not without reason. The power of this magic is different depending on the user. Modu has a strong mental power, and the magic power he can naturally mobilize is also extraordinary. In this case, Mordo's sacred sword of Emperor Weishan is naturally much more powerful than Kaecilius's. The air seemed a little distorted due to the high temperature of Weishan Emperor's sacred sword. This shows how powerful this sword is. Even a tank placed in front of the king would be easily cut open under this attack. Wang Zaran also saw the difference in this thing. But, he is not afraid. I'm not a fool, why should I face your attack? Can't I just attack your body? Shunpo, Wang said. Although he is a simple and honest man, he is not a fool. Why go head to head with magic? Aha, a rustling sound sounded and Wang disappeared on the spot and appeared in front of Mo Du, as if teleporting. Only Mordo knew. This is not teleportation, but the king's speed is too fast. He couldn't even catch his fluctuations. You fat man, how can you be so flexible? This is the first time I've seen such a flexible fat man. Mo Du couldn't help but twitch the corner of his mouth. Wang has a strong build and even looks a bit fat. But I didn't expect that the action would be so fast. His size didn't cause him any problems. What a terrifying power this is. Is this magic book that suffered a natural disaster really so perverted? The power given far exceeds magic. How does this make him fight? 
Although his heart was full of negative emotions, Modu did not give up. His expression changed, and he directly put away his knife to resist. Next moment, he felt a huge force coming from him, and Wang suddenly appeared in front of him. If Modo hadn't responded quickly, I'm afraid Wang's punch will hit him. Wang was also a little surprised by Modu's decisiveness. But next, he punched me again. Boom, a small red round shield suddenly appeared in front of Modu, with mysterious runes flashing on it. Instant casting, you are indeed the strongest among us. Wang punched the shield, sending Modu flying out, and said unexpectedly. Modu is worthy of being a disciple of the Ancient One and a veteran magician. The spell casting turned out to be so fast. In the blink of an eye, he can complete a magic spell, which is much better than an ordinary magician. Snort, my methods are much more than that. Burst. Mordu sneered and shouted directly. Only then did the king discover. Modu's sacred sword of Emperor Weishan has been inserted at his feet. Modu actually took the time to leave, distanced himself from him, and laid this trap. The white gold light suddenly exploded. Powerful energy spurted out. If it were Bono, he might be able to leave instantly. Although Wong is fast, he can't match the energy. You can only cross your arms and resist directly. The hot and terrifying energy exploded directly, as if a small nuclear bomb exploded directly. A radius of more than 10 meters was covered. Everything within range is vaporized. When the smoke dissipated, the ground had disappeared. There is only a large pit with a diameter of more than 10 meters and a depth of several meters. The power of the big magician's attack is evident. But with such power, there was nothing he could do to kill the king. Although Wang's clothes at the bottom of the pit were in tatters, he did not have any injuries on his body. Aha! Wang jumped up directly from the bottom of the pit. Mo Du's face was as gloomy as water. Even the ancient one next to him was a little surprised. This is the divine power of Emperor Weishan after the explosion. If it had been a demon from hell in the middle, I'm afraid there wouldn't even be any dregs left on the ground. Got this blow. Wang didn't suffer any injuries at all. Is this physical quality too outrageous? Much stronger than her physical fitness. At least she would still be injured if she was attacked. Wong is completely different. Is the magic book really about selecting the chosen one? What I gave you was too perverted. The tempered body is not ordinary powerful. Even Lin Yu, who was watching from the side, was amazed. It is indeed a punch that comes from the world of Superman. It's so perverted to the extreme. This kind of physical fitness is completely different from Hulk. Now he is looking forward to the scene after having a body more and more. Chapter 31 Wang's action shocked everyone. The destructive power he caused was no less than that of Hulk. Such purely physical destruction is naturally very shocking to the people of Kamar Taj. However, in Lin Yu's opinion, that's not so good. I have seen the methods of strong men like Hulk and Thanos. Wang's current destructive power is really unacceptable. However, this Modu seems to be a little weak. I think Doctor Strange is pretty fancy. Lin Yu, the guy watching the battle secretly, kept muttering. It's not too big a deal to watch the excitement. The battle Mordo displayed was completely unlike that of a great magician. When Doctor Strange fought Thanos, he showed many tricks. All kinds of magic are just fancy. Why does this Modu look like he doesn't know how to do it at all? Just when Lin Yu was complaining in his heart, he felt that this battle was not interesting. Modu and Wang started talking again. Modu, this kind of trick can't be used against me. Let's show some real skills. You haven't made a move in several years. You haven't made any progress, right? Wang waved his hand and tore off his robe, revealing his extremely strong upper body. His muscles seemed to be cast out of iron. Every piece has edges and corners. It's not as bloated as it appears on the outside. Modu saw his pupils shrink and said calmly, Well, let me see something different for you. Don't blame me for being harsh. A stiff smile appeared on Wang's face. It was as if the whole person had turned into a flashpoint. But before Wang could reach Modu's location, the surrounding space instantly shattered. It was true that the space exploded directly. The space around Wang was like a piece of glass falling from the sky and exploding. Although it didn't make any sound. But Wang's body as he charged forward instantly turned into tens of thousands of pieces. There was still a look of astonishment visible to the naked eye on Wang's face. 
Speaking of being ruthless, Modu really didn't hold back. This method has been used. Even the ancient one who was watching the show couldn't help but sigh in his heart. This guy Modu is really ruthless. He actually used this method to deal with his own people. Instantly expelling people into the broken space, even the demons of hell will be torn into pieces by the power of space. The power of space is the most dangerous power in this world. The ancient one originally wanted to rescue the king. If you fall into this trick and fall into endless space turbulence, you will not only be torn apart by space. There is also the risk of getting lost. Generally speaking, most magicians would not use such dangerous tricks in sparring. It seemed that Modu was indeed annoyed by the king. Only, before Ancient One could take action, he saw an extremely surprising scene. This, Ancient One looked forward, his eyes flashing with surprise. Click, click. The king is constantly walking in the world of fragmented space. A large amount of space debris collided with his body. It's just that the space fragments that can break the bones of ordinary magician duplication can't do anything about it at all. The terrifying space fragments collided with Wang's body, leaving only white traces. But it can't cause any substantial harm at all. What kind of monster body is this? No low dimensional space debris can be separated. Compared to the ancient one, Morduna was dumbfounded. He knew how powerful this magic was. This magic can even easily destroy a world's demon army. The extremely sharp space debris can annihilate all enemies. Only, this guy Wang actually ignored the space fragments and walked out of them. Modo has been a magician for so many years, and he has never seen anything so outrageous. This is so cute. Sorcerer Supreme, what kind of ghost boxing does Wang practice? Magic is not that outrageous. Modu, who had always been a deep-tempered person, couldn't help but curse. It shows how uncomfortable he feels at the moment. This powerful blow had no effect on the king at all. He simply relied on his powerful body to walk out of the turbulent flow of space. Wong grabbed a large piece of space debris with both hands. Click, he squeezed it hard with both hands, and the space was crushed to pieces by him. Pressing down hard with both palms, the vibrations in the surrounding space calmed down instantly. Outrageous, Mo Du's face was ugly, and his heart was full of disbelief. Seeing Wang walking out of the turbulence easily, Mo Du couldn't help but grit his teeth. I don't believe it, isn't this body still invincible? Even those so-called powerful flame demons don't have such terrifying physical fitness. I don't believe your body is invincible. Mo Du couldn't help shouting. Being a big magician, what Wang did was simply provoking his cognition. With his hands clasping together, scarlet light flashed from his side. This is to borrow the power of the powerful god, Cytoric. As one of the eight demon lords, the Crimson Lord, Cytoric possesses unimaginable terrifying power. His magical power is one of the most powerful in all of Kamar Taj. Take the move, Mordo roared angrily. The scarlet energy suddenly changed. It seemed as if a huge guillotine appeared directly in the sky. The scarlet guillotine flashed with extremely sharp light. It was as if nothing could stop this sharp weapon and it was cut in half by this thing. This is also one of Kamar Taj's most dangerous and powerful attacks. Modu once used this magic to directly kill a demonic dragon. Even the monster that dominated the Middle Ages with its physical body was unable to withstand this terrifying attack. This shows how amazing the power of this magic is. Without any exaggeration, even if Ancient One didn't use any other power, he would end up being cut in two if he took on this attack. Modu's eyes sparkled with light. King, you'd better surrender as soon as possible. It's hard for me to control the power of this magic. Modu said with a ferocious smile. I don't think so. Instant body technique. Wang's figure seemed to change into a silvery white stream of water, the trajectory of which was elusive. The next second he appeared in midair, appearing in front of the terrifying magic. He thrust forward with one hand. After tempering, the fingers as strong as diamonds hit the magic. Click. A crisp sound sounded. The magic composed of Cytorak's divine power and exuding a terrifying aura was shattered by the king in an instant. I, Modu couldn't help but curse loudly. This guy is too outrageous. This boxing technique is unreasonable. How can magic, an energy creation and pure physical power, be so easily destroyed? The things in the magic book are so outrageous. Lin Yu is very satisfied with Wang's performance. 
In other words, I am very satisfied with the power provided by the system. The king's strength has not yet reached the corresponding peak, but he already has such power. Even among the Avengers, he can be ranked at the top. This shows how powerful the system is. Lin Yu has gained the most powerful power. When he has a human body, wouldn't it mean that when he comes out, he will kill gods and Buddhas? Think of this. Lin Yu couldn't help but laugh. I don't know how his current strength compares to Thanos. After all, reality is not a movie, so maybe something will change. Quicksilver can be killed by bullets. The water in this world is really too deep, and Lin Yu feels that it is better for him to stay a little longer. It would be better if a few more people could understand the power. Pity. System comprehension also has certain requirements, which limits the number of people. Regardless of this, let's see how far Wang can perform. As a great magician, I have rich combat experience, so I might be able to innovate. Lin Yu realized the scene in the mirror space. Wang Zheng's body was extremely powerful, like a wild bull, and he had already approached Modu. There are no fancy moves. It was just an ordinary punch with silvery white light. Modu suddenly changed his color. After sealing at the speed of light, his fingers were left with residual images, and then a red magic shield condensed in front of him. Wang's fist hit directly. Boom, there was a muffled sound. In the face of the king's terrifying power, this magic shield could not withstand it at all. This terrifying magic shield based on the power of gods was actually destroyed by the king with one punch. Red energy is flying all over the sky. Modu, who was on the opposite side, looked livid. If he hadn't been smart enough to retreat in time, he might have been affected. The king's body is too terrifying and his power is too powerful. Just blowing up the wind casually is like an actual barometric cannon attack. Being able to physically shatter a magic shield with deity's power is no longer considered human. Modu's heart moved. His face became even uglier. Nothing else. Wong has already caught up with him, and he will probably not give up until he gives him a good beating. Don't even think about it. Mordo gritted his teeth. As the number one magician in Kamar Taj, doesn't he want to lose face? A stroke of both hands. A golden portal appeared, and he wanted to use it to banish the king. Even an ordinary magician can deal with a fool like Hulk. Only brute force can't deal with Kamar Taj's space magic. Only. Wong is different. He was previously a senior magician at Kamar Taj. He practiced Liasui and Shattering Fist because the boxing technique was stronger and more powerful. It doesn't mean that he has given up on the way of magic. In fact, because the Lias Haoyan Shattering Fist strengthened his body and nourished his soul. His mental strength is even stronger than before. The power of magic is also greatly increased. Even in terms of pure magical attainments, Wang is probably not weaker than Modu. Golden light flashed on his hands. He actually grabbed the covered portal with both hands and used force with both hands. Just tear the portal apart. It's as easy as tearing a piece of paper. You guys, didn't you agree to discuss new abilities? How do you use magic power? Modu cursed loudly, which really broke his defense a bit. Hey, I forgot. Wong just smiled honestly. Modu was so angry that he almost vomited blood. This guy is really too much. I don't believe you are still invincible. I'm a big magician. Mordo took a deep breath. A golden light flashed, and the portal appeared next to him. He actually teleported himself more than 10 meters away. Then he claps his hands and seals at the speed of light. Red bloodshot eyes appeared in his eyes, as if he was under great pressure. A moment, three different rays of light appeared around him. Terrifying energy fluctuations gathered around Modu, and the surrounding air became a little distorted. Mordo is indeed the best among the great magicians of Kamar Taj. He actually created three powerful magics at the same time. All of them are equipped with terrifying magic of deity's power. A huge scarlet wheel more than 10 meters high, and a huge lightsaber more than 10 meters long. There was also a yellow gold thunder light. I think you can't bear it. Mordo roared angrily. The veins on his face popped out, which was a sign that his mental strength was reaching its limit. Under Modu's control, three terrifying magics came out. I don't believe it, you can still handle this. Modu was panting and said through gritted teeth. The three terrifying deities' power magics all reached the limit that he could activate. 
Among them is Kamar Taja's most powerful attack magic, Bossat's Thunder. The Golden Thunder continued to spread on the ground. The ground is constantly cracking, as if some monster underground is constantly moving, causing the ground to tear. In the sky, the Scarlet Giant Wheel and Lightsaber are no less impressive. The dazzling light made the sky appear two colors. The surrounding cosmic energy is like boiling water, boiling extremely. Even Ancient One couldn't help but glance at Modu. I didn't expect him to be able to perform such a terrifying attack. Deliberately teasing those who are slightly surprised, it shows how terrifying this attack is. Wang Yi's face was serious, but he didn't show any nervousness. Silvery white light gathered around his body, like substance. Flowing water formation. The silvery white light is like flowing water. But in fact, this was just an illusion caused by Wang's movements too quickly. An almost circular defense formed around the king. Under this situation, three terrifying magics attacked directly. The moment the four collided, the world seemed to stand still. Next moment, huge amounts of energy explode directly. Energy storms of three colors appeared around. The dazzling light covered everything, and a mushroom cloud rose directly into the sky. After a few minutes, the smoke slowly dissipated. A large pit with a diameter of dozens of meters was left where Wang was. There are radioactive lines all around, as if an aerial bomb exploded here. This is impossible, Modu exclaimed, the expression on his face was extremely shocked. He saw the king in the center of the pit. Unscathed. The terrifying attack just now did not leave any injuries on the king. He can't accept it. That was the full attack of a big magician like him. He knew that his attack might not cause any serious injury to the king, and the Sorcerer Supreme didn't even take action. But, this is unscathed and a little too outrageous. He used some of Kamar Taja's most powerful attack magic. This already represents the upper limit of a big magician. The king is just like a normal person. What else is there to fight? Modu immediately shut himself down. Okay, that's it. The calm voice of the Ancient One rang out in the mirror dimension. Look at the muscles on Wang's body that are like steel. Look at Modu, who is a little weak. She was afraid that if the two of them started fighting again, Modu would be beaten to death by Wang Yi. The king's strength has exceeded the scope of ordinary magicians, and he fully possesses the strength that only those legendary beings possess. This is extremely unscientific and unreasonable in the magical world. The Ancient One lived for 400 years. Except for those lucky ones who suddenly gained deity's power, no one has ever been able to suddenly gain such powerful power. More importantly, this power was not given by others, but was obtained by Wang himself through practice. It's incredible, Ancient One couldn't help but sigh in his heart. But he soon stopped thinking about it. The matter in front of him still needs to be dealt with, and Modu is almost autistic from the shock. As soon as Ancient One raised his head, the king walked up respectfully. Sorcerer Supreme, you don't see the problem. Wong asked somewhat speculatively. Even if he is sure that this inheritance and magic book are only good for him. But the Ancient One might find something wrong. This is a world with evil gods. And the existence of evil is very numerous. Their number is roughly equal to the number of superheroes on Earth. He was not entirely sure that this was not a conspiracy by some powerful evil being. Fortunately, Ancient One's next words reassured Wang. Don't worry, I didn't find anything wrong. This is your own power. It's an endless road. Continue to practice, and you may be able to achieve achievements that are unimaginable by ordinary people. Ancient One said in a gentle tone. Of course she can also see it. The king has embarked on a path completely different from the magic of this world, and one with amazing potential. What he is exerting now is just one of ten thousand of this power. If you keep going, you won't necessarily be weaker than her. Thank you magician, I understand. The king looked happy. Ancient One's words were like a reassurance for him. After receiving the affirmation from Ancient One, I can finally practice with peace of mind. He could feel that his power was far from reaching the limit that this inheritance could achieve. My mind settled down. Wong Kai looked at Ancient One sheepishly and then at Modu. Sorcerer Supreme, Mordo, is he okay? At this moment, Modu looked at the sky with an expressionless face. His eyes were full of confusion, as if he was pursuing some meaning in life. He looks like an eminent monk who has understood the secrets of the world. 
Ancient One also took a look at Modu. Don't worry, he will come out. Being a magician is not so fragile. He's just a little surprised. Ancient One didn't know what to say. In the end I can only conclude. If she were not the Sorcerer Supreme, she would have seen the vastness and vastness of this world, and seen things that ordinary people could not understand. She might be similar to Modo now. The power that Wong displayed was too provocative to one's perception. If you just get the inheritance of the magic book, you can easily become so powerful. So what's the point of their hard training? Good thing. The Ancient One understands that this world is unfair. Some people are born into rich families and enjoy endless wealth throughout their lives, while some people are born into poverty and cannot have enough to eat. Is this fair? Unfair. But that's how the world is. In the 400 years she has been alive, what has she not seen? She has even seen a lucky person get the favor of a great being and suddenly become more powerful than her. The world is irrational. Just be yourself. She believed that Modu would eventually understand this truth. After glancing at Modu, Ancient One's eyes became profound again. King, do you have anything else to say? Nature. Sorcerer Supreme, who do you think the magic book says is the chosen one to resist future disasters? It's somewhat believable. Wong asked. This was the only doubt in his mind. The magic book says that he is the chosen one to deal with future disasters. This sounds like you are trying to deceive people. Even in this world of superheroes running around. This is still very inconsistent and unusual. The Chosen One. Ancient One glanced at Wong, who couldn't help but feel a little embarrassed. The truth of the word, Chosen One, is never known. The disasters coming in the future will not come out of nowhere. Ancient One looked into the distance, his eyes filled with mysterious light. She can see the future and observe destiny. She can only find the one she thinks is best among the endless fates. Even if it means sacrificing one's own life, there is no exception. No one can predict the future. Perhaps one year will lead to countless branches in the future. Now that you have this ability, you don't have to think too much, just practice well. After a moment of silence, Ancient One asked. I understand Sorcerer Supreme. Wong also nodded silently. Then do you think the emergence of this so-called magic book is a good thing or a bad thing? What impact does it have on us Kamar Taj? Wong asked again. After staying in Kamar Taj for a long time, they all understand the truth. Strength does not mean stronger is better. In this world, having strong power may not be a good thing. Wong was very happy to obtain this power. He just has to consider whether the impact of this incident on the entire Kamar Taj is good or bad. I have no idea, Ancient One said calmly. A flash of astonishment flashed in Wang's eyes. You don't know. Wang's tone was even more full of surprise. So far, the image the Ancient One displayed in front of him was extremely wise and omniscient. This was the first time he saw that there was something that even the Ancient One didn't know about. This made Wang a little confused as to what to do. Seeing him like this, Ancient One smiled instead. Isn't this normal? King, I am just a mortal, I just happen to have more power than ordinary people. I may be able to peek into a certain future, but I am not omniscient and omnipotent. At least, I haven't discovered this magic book yet, right? There are still many things in this world that I don't know. This time is no exception. Ancient One's voice was gentle, and he didn't look like a powerful magician at all. But, when the king heard his voice, he felt a little relieved. I understand, Sorcerer Supreme. I will take a closer look at the magic book. I will definitely not let this matter develop in a bad direction. Wong said firmly. That's good. Ancient One also smiled and nodded. With Modu, who was a little distracted, the three of them left the mirror dimension. Lin Yu is sure now. The power of the system was beyond his imagination. The ability provided to him is also very powerful. When the Ancient One was here, he almost didn't dare to use his knowledge and knowledge for fear of being discovered. But, the magic book comes with the ability to spy, which is like spiritual power, but it is very useful. Not even the Ancient One can detect it. Even Lin Yu observed Ancient One practicing magic at close range, but Ancient One still didn't find anything wrong. This ability is really scary. Ancient One who is that? That's the Sorcerer Supreme, the strongest man on earth at this stage. When she was alive, Thanos didn't even dare to come to earth and act unruly. 
This one was shown to have defeated the powerful Dark Space Lord Dormammu hundreds of years ago. It can even directly extract the power of the Dark Space to extend life. After all these years, it still doesn't matter. Dormammu, on the other hand, was corrupted just by reading the magic book. It can be seen how big the gap is between the Ancient One and these magicians, and it can be seen how terrifying the power of this level Godfather is. If she wanted to, she could even easily wipe out civilization on Earth. Such a being can't even discover the power given to him by the system. The power of the system can be imagined. Lin Yu could only lament the power of the system. The shortcomings of beauty are. There are too few people who can pass it on. Another month has passed since the last time Ancient One came back. The Ancient One also left Kamar Taj again, without a trace. The library in the past is also bustling again. But, Lin Yu still hasn't found a guy who can be recognized by the magic book. Lin Yu was even a little skeptical. Is it because the requirements of the magic book are too high? Haven't found anyone for so long. It's really outrageous. If this continues, when will I be able to possess a human body? Lin Yu couldn't help but complain. He naturally knows that power is not something everyone can bear. But still a bit disappointed. After all, it is too boring to be a magic book. There is no fun except watching these magicians practice. Things that ordinary people could do before, such as eating and sleeping, have become very luxurious things. It's really boring. And because no one can get the inheritance. Even the library became deserted again and very deserted. Think about it too. There are very few magicians in the library. The reason why it attracts people is that magic books can inherit powerful power. No one has gained power in such a long time. People who try their luck will naturally not come again. In other words, the number of people trying their luck has been greatly reduced. You deserve it that you don't get the chance. There is no lasting faith at all. Lin Yu couldn't help but rolled his eyes and cursed secretly. But the good thing is, Lin Yu's psychological adjustment ability is different from ordinary people, and she becomes very happy. For an ordinary person, a book would have made him depressed. Never mind, if I can't find it, I'll go watch a magician fight. It's also quite interesting. Lin Yu comforted himself in his heart. The excitement of seeing, hearing, and hearing was fully activated, directly covering the entire library. The departure of the Ancient One made Lin Yu unscrupulous again, checking everything around him at will. Among Kamar Taj, no one has more powerful power than him, so naturally no one notices it. Not to mention, seeing, hearing and color is originally called the mind's eye. It's not something that ordinary people can detect. I read several magicians in the library, but none of them caused any fluctuations in the magic books. Just when Lin Yu thought he was going to be disappointed again. A figure caught his attention. This is a very young guy, he looks to be in his twenties, he should be an ordinary magician among Kamar Taj. If there is any difference between him and ordinary people. That's how sunny this kid is. There are two flower pots in his hands. And judging by his appearance, what he was holding didn't seem to be a flower pot, but a gold ingot, which he cherished very much. Just by looking at him, Lin Yu knew that young people must like this green plant very much. Holding two flower pots, he walked into the library. He carefully placed the flower pot on the ground and replaced the wilted potted plants in the library. Don't look at Kamar Taj as a magical force. Apart from saving the world, magicians are still ordinary people who also have to eat, drink and defecate. Naturally, the design of this library is no different from that of ordinary people. Inside, there are also green plants for decoration. It's different from the outside. Ordinary people have to buy green plants from stores, but the green plants in this library are cultivated by the magicians of Kamar Taj themselves. Give the magicians some chores. This is also how Kamar Taj cultivates magicians. Kamar Taj never advocates getting something for nothing. This guy should be one of the magicians responsible for managing and cultivating various ornamental plants and landscape trees here. Most of these magicians have no ability. Maybe he can reach the level of a senior magician in his lifetime. But he is such an ordinary person. It actually made the magic book react. The criteria for selecting talents in this magic book are really random. I don't know what it relies on. But now that you're here, don't even think about leaving, kid. Jaehyeji. Lin Yu smiled. Naturally, 
that young man didn't know that he was being targeted by Lin Yu. He is happily serving the green plants. First, I gently wiped the dust off the green plants with a flannel cloth, and then poured some water. That gentle look is not like treating a plant, but like treating his own wife. It's easy to see, he really likes these green plants. Otherwise, there would never be such a heartfelt smile. While processing, he was still talking to himself. I still need to give some advice to the magicians. Too little light in the library is not very good for the plants. The buildings in Kamar Taj are still too old. As he spoke, he couldn't help but sigh and shake his head. The buildings in Kamar Taj can be said to be antiques. In other countries, it is more or less a national cultural relic level building. Over the years, the magicians at Kamar Taj have tinkered with it so that it does not hinder its use. But there was a problem with the original design. No matter how we fix it now, it won't help. Not only is the space a bit small, lighting is also a big problem. Pity, this is not something that an ordinary little magician like him can solve. What he can do, just take good care of these plants and prevent them from getting sick. Change the pots and take care of the plants. He nodded with satisfaction. Pick up the flower pot and prepare to leave. Wow. Wow. At this moment, he heard the sound of turning pages in his ears. He was originally not interested in magic, but he couldn't help but look in the direction of the sound. Qian He is an unknown little magician, responsible for maintaining various green plants in Kamar Taj. It can be said that compared to the magicians responsible for fighting, he has no sense of existence. Even in Kamar Taj, which claims to be egalitarian, the chain of contempt still exists. After so many years, Qian He has become accustomed to it. The original idea of becoming a strong superhero has faded away in so many years of life. What he wants now is to do his own thing quietly. Anyway, he also likes all kinds of plants, and this kind of life is exactly what he wants. Therefore, he did not pay attention to the legend of the magic book that was spreading in Kamar Taj. He has never been to the library. This time when he came to the library, he just changed the plants and left immediately. Only, the sound of turning books in his ears still made him stop. Gudong, Qian he swallowed. There was a look of disbelief on his face. The nearest book to him was more than 10 meters away. How could he hear the sound of turning pages? Qian he turned around stiffly. He saw a mysterious magic book placed on the table not far in front of him. This magic book looks quite strange. The cover looks very gorgeous, with crystal-like textures on it, emitting yellow light. The patterns on it are looming, and you will feel dazzled when you look at them too much. Qian He withdrew his gaze and swallowed again. He still remembered that there was clearly a huge amount of screen behind him, but where was the table? Moment, Qian He remembered the widespread legend of Kamar Taj. Among the descriptions of many magicians, the magic book that can inherit mysterious power seems to appear out of nowhere. Before this, no one could see this magic book. Unconsciously, Qian He put down the flower pot in his hand and walked towards the table step by step. The further they walked, the faster Qian He's breathing became, for fear that the magic book would disappear again. Good thing, this magic book has not undergone any changes. Instead, he stayed quietly on the hardwood table and waited for his arrival. Qian He sat down in front of the table without any hesitation, and grabbed the magic book with both hands, for fear that the magic book would disappear. At the same time, in Lin Yu's mind, the voice of the system rang. A magician has been detected who is qualified for comprehension. Should this magician realize power? The system prompt sounds. Yes, Lin Yu said decisively in his heart. The host confirms that the magician is qualified to comprehend. Power understanding in progress. Lin Yu felt a little excited. After waiting for so long, the system finally selected a magician again to inherit the power. He was also able to add another level of strength. I just don't know what kind of power this magician can obtain. He has now also observed some patterns. The power inherited by the system seems to be distributed based on the characteristics of the magician or the characteristics of the characters in the original world. Being able to gain strength must be a characteristic of some aspect and meet the conditions of the system. I hope this kid in front of me can bring him some surprises. Lin Yu set his sights on the magician. The magic book now exudes that mysterious power. 
This space seemed to have been stripped away from the library, and no one noticed the abnormality happening here. According to Lin Yu, this should be more accurately called cognitive interference. Under the influence of system forces, everyone will subconsciously ignore everything around them. It is equivalent to directly interfering with people's consciousness, which is extremely terrifying. Under this kind of interference, no one in Kamar Taj could notice what was happening in the library. The powerful power in the magic book burst out and was directly injected into Qian He's body. A mysterious mark appears. Dark green marks appeared on Qian He's face, as if they were tattoos. He seemed to have fallen directly into a hallucination, with a confused look in his eyes. Under the influence of this magical power, Qian He seemed to have gone to another world and experienced another person's life. He has been a genius since he was a child, possessing powerful abilities and strength. After constant training, he has become one of the few strong men in the world. When the world is in chaos, take decisive action. Relying on his powerful strength and outstanding charisma, he directly quelled the troubled times and built a huge amount of power. In his life, he defeated countless opponents, and even his strongest opponents were suppressed by his subordinates. He became a living legend, with the phantom constantly changing. The figure's life experience was also poured into his mind. Qian He's mood also became more and more exciting. Senju Hashirama. In confusion, Qian He said such a name. Then the power of the magic book slowly disappeared. At the same time, the system's voice also sounded in Lin Yu's mind. Complete understanding of power. The magician's comprehension power is. Naruto World, Blood Succession Limit, would release. A magician learns the power from the magic book. You get a 10,000 times critical hit return. Congratulations on obtaining a mortal level would escape. Congratulations on unlocking sage mode and obtaining a Sura Chakra. Do you want to receive it? The sound of the system sounded, and Lin Yu's eyes widened immediately. It turned out to be Mudden. The first Hokage of Konoha village, the power of Senju Hashirama. Who is Senju Hashirama? That is the man who is known as the god of ninja. Uchiha Madara has nothing to offer, so he can only succumb to him. Among the strongest people in the entire Naruto world, Senju Hashirama can definitely be ranked in the top 10. In addition to the two wall-mounted protagonists, there are also those aliens. He is afraid of no one. He has reached the level of Naruto, the ultimate human being. Unexpectedly, a mediocre little magician would gain such powerful power. Now he felt this power too. Would escape. This extremely powerful blood inheritance limit. This feeling. You can easily mobilize any plant. Create an attack out of nowhere. Lin Yu's face was full of shock. Just thinking about it now, he could instantly plunge the entire Kamar Taj into a sea of trees. This kind of power can only be used as an auxiliary in other worlds. In the hands of Senju Hashirama, it exerted unimaginable destructive power. Now his power belongs to Lin Yu. This is too strong. I'm afraid this can easily destroy a city. The power of Mu Dun is indeed outrageous. Feel the chakra in your body and the attack range it can cover. Lin Yu couldn't help but shake his head. He's now a walking nuclear weapon. Easily destroy the city. The energy of Mu Dun is too terrifying. The system is really a bit abnormal. Lin Yu knows Naruto very well. He understands the gold content of Mu Dun very well, and understands how terrifying this power is when it is used to the extreme. So he was very excited and shocked. And these things, money and money don't know. As a small magician, he may not have seen Kamar Taja's high-level magic. How do you know about Mu Dun? But it was precisely because of this that Qian he was shocked. Would release. What kind of power is this, high-level magic? No, this is a completely different kind of power from magic. Qian he couldn't help but exclaimed in his heart. Magic is the use of spiritual power to mobilize the ubiquitous cosmic power in this world. But the purpose of Mu Dun is different. Chakra is a burst of life energy. Wood escape is derived from this basis. This is a method that relies entirely on the power of the human body. The two are completely different. Qian He, who had only been exposed to magic before, was naturally very surprised by this. He had no idea that such power actually existed in this world. The legend of this magic book is actually true. I will be completely different from now on. I can be a fighting magician too.
Qian Yi's eyes shone with excitement. These two are completely different concepts. Although the power of this wood escape can also perceive plants and allow him to take better care of them, but is this power not only used for this? The greatest use of wood release is still for fighting. Its combat effectiveness is astonishing. I have mastered so many ninjutsu just from the beginning. The inheritance of this wood escape is so terrifying. And this power called chakra is almost like a part of the body. Qian He Tan stretched out his hand, and an invisible force lingered on his hand. This is completely different from the power of magic, which is really surprising. He didn't have much ability in magic, but now he doesn't have to worry at all. He has mastered wood release. This kind of powerful power is not weaker than magic at all. Even in terms of certain evils, Mu Dun is more powerful than magic. However, judging from the description, Mu Dun is indeed very powerful. I just don't know how powerful it is. I can only master seven or eight kinds. Qian He couldn't help but become curious. There are many extreme ninjutsu in wood release. Things like the advent of the tree world, the art of the wooden dragon, the thousands of hands of immortal magic, etc. are simply not something he can master at his level. I'm afraid that without using magic, he would be drained of chakra in an instant. In the description, these extreme magical powers are also very terrifying. If you practice to the extreme, you can even destroy a city with ease. He could only think about this kind of thing. How about trying the most basic wood escape power first? With the power I have just mastered, I can judge what its future will be like. Qian he thought in his heart. Qian Hujian looked around guiltily and found that there was no one around, and the magic book disappeared to nowhere. Then he looked at the library pillar in front of him. This is a wooden pillar with a diameter of more than half a meter. It is mainly used for decoration. The wood is very hard. Even if he uses magic, he can't completely destroy such a large wooden pillar. He now plans to see how powerful this wood release is. Wood release. Thorn killing technique. Qian he growled lowly and quickly formed seals with his hands. Due to his lack of proficiency, his speed in forming seals is still a bit slow, and his chakra manipulation is not that smooth. But this did not prevent him from using ninjutsu at all. The moment the seal ends, a piece of dust suddenly exploded on the ground, and four square logs, as thick as an average person's calf, grew out of the ground. The wood looks flat and vertical, like treated wood building materials. But what surprised Qian He was that this seemingly extremely hard wood moved with his thoughts. It's not as flexible as wood at all, but like four snakes. Qian He took a breath. Wood can actually do this. It's amazing. Qian He blinked his eyes and marveled. Strangulation. After feeling it for a while, Qian He issued the order. The four pieces of wood were like poisonous snakes, rushing towards the thick wooden pillar in front of them. In direct violation of common sense, these four pieces of wood were wrapped around the pillar. Crunch, crunch, there was an unpleasant sound. Huge power burst out from these four pieces of wood. These four pieces of wood actually directly squeezed and exploded the huge amounts of pillars, and sawdust erupted from them. Hiss, it's really amazing. It's more powerful than ordinary magic. Mudden is so terrifying. Money and eyes light up. With his level of magic power, it would take a lot of effort to destroy the huge amounts of pillars. The hardwood pillars with a diameter of half a meter are no less hard than rocks. The magic of ordinary magicians cannot cause damage at all. Now Mu Dun can crush it easily, which shows how terrifying the power of Mu Dun is. With Mu Dun, I will definitely become a strong person. I can be a superhero too. Qian Yi's eyes lit up and he couldn't help but exclaimed. Look at your ignorant look. It's just an ordinary ninjutsu. Just when Qian Yi was proud, a voice sounded from his ears. Who? Qian Yi's eyes were immediately filled with vigilance, and he looked around, trying to find the source of the sound. But no matter how hard he opened his eyes, he found nothing. Is it my imagination? Qian Yi couldn't help but talk to himself. It's definitely not your illusion. Did you forget that I just gave you the magic? A dull voice sounded. Qian Yi's eyes suddenly widened. The space in front of him rippled like water waves, and golden magic books slowly emerged from it. It's like going from fantasy to reality. The magic book has spoken. Qian Yi stared suddenly. He is just a little magician, but he is not as knowledgeable as other magicians. 
When he saw Lin Yu talking, he had a shocked expression on his face. What's weird about talking? Lin Yu Ke said calmly. Qian he thought about it after hearing this. It seems to make sense. They are able to inherit such incredible power, and the magic book can speak, so it doesn't seem to be a big deal. What do you want? Qian He's expression became respectful. There's definitely something going on. With such power, you can be considered a candidate for the chosen one. You need to work hard to be effective in the face of future disasters. And just show your own strength. Lin Yu said calmly. Money and complexion. He seems to know why the rumors about the magic book in Kamartaj have become more and more intense. Qian He is a young man after all. Not at all comparable to a cunning guy like Lin Yu. He was immediately deceived by Lin Yu. I firmly believe in Lin Yu's words. It took a lot of effort for Qian He to calm down. Then, he began to clean up the mess in front of him. In order to test the power of magic, he used the pillar as a test object before, but now he needs to repair it. Fortunately, he had foresight. Mudden is the art of playing with wood. There is no problem in manipulating an ordinary piece of wood. All he had to do was use wood release to repair it, and the damage he had caused before would be completely invisible. Thinking of this, Qian he started to manipulate without hesitation. The power of chakra flows through his body. As his spirit fluctuated, the wooden pillar in front of him that was more than half a meter thick and was crushed by him slowly changed. As if going back in time, these huge amounts of hardwood pillars seemed to be slowly being repaired. To say that it is repaired is actually not complete because this is not repair, but rebirth. Among these wooden pillars, wooden tissue is constantly being slowly born to fill the original position. There are sawdust falling from above constantly around. It looks very fantastic. What kind of magic is this? Time magic. No, no, this isn't magic at all. Just as Qian he was concentrating on repairing the pillar in front of him, an old and gentle voice rang in his ears. Qian He shook his body and immediately stopped what he was doing. Turn around. However, he discovered that the person standing behind him was none other than an old man with a slim figure and a goatee wearing gold rimmed glasses. Seeing this man, Qian He took a deep breath and saluted quickly. See Hamel the Great Magician. This appeared in the money and behind it was none other than one of the great magicians of Kamar Taj, Hamel. In the movie, the Ancient One once found a magician who was missing his left hand to demonstrate magic to Doctor Strange, and had some respect for him. It was none other than Hamel. Kamar Taj is the most inspirational magician. With a defective body, he achieves the position of a great magician. He is also very popular among low-level magicians, and even the Ancient One respects him very much. Qian He was naturally nervous when he suddenly saw such a legendary figure. But, Hamel behaved very gently. Don't be so nervous. I'm not a bad person. Are you using mysterious means? Hamel smiled gently, stroked his goatee, and spoke very curiously. Although Hamel is quite senior, he is considered the biggest magician in Kamar Taj's class. But his eyes were very bright, like a child's. At such an age, with such a clear heart, it is naturally impossible for ordinary people to do so. Qian He was also very envious. Revelation to the great magician, this is wood release. Wood escape. Hamel seemed a little confused. But he soon reacted. As a great magician, he has naturally heard rumors about magic books. I didn't expect to see it now. A completely different power from Kamar Taj magic, it looks like it comes from a magic book. Thinking of this, infinite curiosity emerged in Hamel's heart. Mind showing me something? Hamel asked very politely. Qian He was a little flattered. It's my pleasure. Just magician, can you let me finish the things in front of me and then go to the training ground? Qian he said rather embarrassed. He regrets it now. He was excited when he got mutton before, so he tried mutton in the library. Now it seems that it is just asking for trouble. Of course you can. Hamel stroked his beard and nodded. At the same time, he looked at Qian he with curiosity. He took a deep breath and began to manipulate the power of Mudun to continue repairing the pillar. Destruction is always harder. It was easy to crush the pillar, but it took a lot of effort to restore it again. Even if he mastered the wood release, it was still no exception. He needs his undivided attention. Money and care in restoration. Hamel saw everything. 
The wood that had been dead for a long time seemed to be very resurrected at this moment. Constantly, wood tissue is born again from this wood. What ability is this? Create something out of nothing. Create something out of thin air. Hamel gasped. Kamar Taja's magic has never been so perverted. The creation of direct species being. Kamar Taja's magic has never been able to create energy weapons. And this so-called wood escape, which directly converts energy into physical matter, is really terrifying. Interesting, interesting. I didn't expect that the so-called magic book would be so magical. There really is something magical like this in this world. Hamel was in a happy mood, with a strange light shining in his eyes. He really wanted to see it now. How far can this so-called wood escape go? Such a short effort. Qian He also finished repairing the pillar in front of him. Qian He wiped the sweat from his forehead and looked at Hamel. Magician, I'm ready. Qian He said. Very good. Follow me. Hamel nodded, unhurriedly. A wave of his hand. The space in front of them suddenly distorted, as if the space was shattered, and a large number of cracks appeared. Mirror dimension. Qian He couldn't help but widen his eyes. Hamel, the magician is so powerful. Turning on the mirror dimension is so easy. With excitement, he followed Hamel and walked in. The mirror dimension is a mirror of the world, and the scenery inside is exactly the same as the outside. Only, Hamel waved his hand, and the surrounding space transformed and the scenery changed. Everything in the library shrank and disappeared, directly transformed into a huge amounts of platform. Come on, boy, let me see what's so mysterious about your wood release. This is not inferior to the power of magic. Don't let me down. Hamel offered gentle encouragement. As the grand magician of Kamar Taj, he is highly accomplished in magic. Perhaps he is no match for Modu or Wong in terms of combat effectiveness. But when it comes to magic research, he is much more powerful than these two. This is entirely due to his observation and careful study of everything in the world. Now, something new appeared before him. How could he not be moved? What else can this so-called wood release do besides converting energy into matter? Is it aggressive, or can it only be used as an auxiliary? What is the principle behind this? What is the difference between this seal and magician? Hamel was very curious about all this. He looked at Qian He, hoping to give him some surprise. Qian He took a deep breath and started taking action. Hamel is the eldest grand magician of Kamar Taj. In his youth he was not a magician, but a servant of the Ancient One. Just from this juice, you can imagine how many years he has experienced. When Doctor Strange first came to Kamar Taj, Hamel even blatantly reads in the Ancient One's place also mistaken for the ancient one by strange. It can be seen that his status is respected. Because of his age, his combat power may not be the highest, but his understanding of magic is the second highest among Kamar Taj. To a certain extent, this is also true, Hamel is definitely not a regular magician. But even so, he still doesn't understand the money and the wood escape in his hand. This was completely beyond his comprehension. Fortunately, after so many years of experience, he was still able to maintain the reserve of a great magician and did not show any gaff expression. I just feel a little emotional in my heart. He had heard before that there was a mysterious magic book in Kamar Taj, but he thought these were just rumors. Now I didn't expect that this matter was actually true. In this world, there actually is a magic book that can give people mysterious power. It looks like I'm going to visit the king later. I heard that this kid has also been inherited. I don't know how this kid's power is different from the kid in front of me. Hamel thought in his mind. In terms of his qualifications and age, the powerful king is just a young man in front of him. Now let's study this boy's wonderful wood escape first. This should also be a spell that uses the energy of the universe, but it is different from magic. Hamel's eyes shone with wisdom. He studied magic and studied it all his life. He has a very deep understanding of the nature of magic. Although he temporarily understood the principle of wood escape, he could indeed see something. But before that, he still needs to want to continue observing. Okay, kid, come on, show me. How far can your wood release be? This ability can be used for more than just fighting, right? Hamel's eyes sparkled with curiosity. Although he was already quite old, there was no trace of the vicissitudes of old age in his eyes. Instead, it is full of purity, just like a child. 
The eyes are full of innocence. But this did not hinder the money and admiration for the elder magician. Enlightenment to the great magician. Mudden can indeed be used for more than just fighting. We can also use chakra to manipulate plants or make other things. Qian he explained obediently. Show me quickly. Hamel's eyes widened. Magic is also a magical power. Magic can also be used in life. Doctor Strange can even use magic to tie himself. It's just that their use of magic is not as good as the magicians in the Harry Potter world. Their magic is fully applied to life. He was curious. Could this wood release be any different? Saw Hamel looking at him curiously. Money and no hesitation. He started the chakra inside Sao Sao. A weak energy was running through her body. A complex hand seal was formed in his hand, controlled by the energy of chakra. The tree world is coming. Qian Hegao shouted and patted down. Kayla, the ground broke directly. A sapling broke through the ground and grew out, and Sun Tzu grew. In the blink of an eye, the tree grew into a big tree as thick as a bucket. Qian he cannot fully master high-level ninjutsu, but he can fully master this ninjutsu that has been weakened tens of thousands of times. Summon a tree through chakra. It seemed useless and inconspicuous, but in Hamel's eyes, it was enough to surprise him. He stepped forward and touched the bark of the tree. They are completely real trees, no different from ordinary trees. What a strange ability. Material regeneration and accelerated growth are simply the power that touches the realm of the creator. Hamel said excitedly, even for a magician, Mudden's function is indeed a bit incredible. Recreating a tree out of thin air may seem ordinary, but it is definitely something beyond imagination. This involves energy and material transformation, as well as rapid growth of trees and changes in organizational structure. If ordinary people could see it, it would probably subvert scientific understanding. Even among them Kamar Taj, this is a great trick. It's amazing. It's amazing. This is much more powerful than magic. It's not destructive, its essence seems to be beyond magic. Magic is just the manipulation of energy. It seems to be a higher level, something close to law. Hamel was astonished, and there were countless praises in his words. Is it really that powerful? Qian he scratched his head. He knew that Mu Dun's ability was very terrifying. After all, in the description of ninjutsu, the top ninjutsu has the power to destroy the world. But he didn't expect that Mu Dun would be so powerful in Hamel's description. Don't underestimate this power. It's a very powerful force. What you have now is just a scratch. Hamel said with a smile. The light of magic shone in his hands, as if he was studying the trees that were suddenly born. Under his power, the tree was directly broken open, revealing the tree tissue inside, which was no different from ordinary trees. It's incredible. This is actually true. Hamel sighed with emotion. Isn't this just the simplest thing? There is something even more powerful. Qian he said. Oh oh oh, show me quickly. Hamel's eyes suddenly lit up. Qian he also started to act as he was told. As his hands moved, complex handprints began to condense between his hands. Chakra began to flow through his body. Four pillar house. Qian he shouted loudly, and powerful power flowed through his body. Qian he just slapped the ground suddenly. Many roots suddenly appeared on the ground, and these roots were constantly squirming and growing. It doesn't take a while. A house made entirely of wood appeared in front of them. It looks exactly like the building in Kamar Taj, except it is made entirely of wood. Also quite exquisite. A trace of visible astonishment flashed through Hamel's eyes. Mudden can still be used like this. His voice was also full of surprise. In this space, Lin Yu, who had been paying attention to all this, couldn't help but grin. Thousand Arms Pillar, what a name. Back then, no one in the ninja world dared to show his face. How could Yamato, who had acquired the first generation cells, be able to develop this kind of ninjutsu? Can only say, times have changed whether it's Lin Yu or Hamel. They were all shocked by Qian He's skills in the Four Pillars. Who could have imagined that this wood release could unleash thousands of hands that could destroy the world and destroy the earth? How could it still play such a role? To some extent. Yamato can also be regarded as a pioneer, and he has developed wood escape to an astonishing level. But, this is a very amazing thing for Hamel who doesn't know the truth at all. Only, they didn't have time to sigh for long. A portal suddenly appeared in the space. 
The mirror dimension is a reflection of real space. This is not a space created by magic, but a real space. This is a reflection independent of real space, a strange dimension. Anyone can enter the mirror dimension as long as they master the correct opening method. Most ordinary magicians enter here by opening a portal. The ability to break apart space and enter, an ability exclusive to a small number of powerful magicians. Under this situation, the only one who can open the portal is Kamar Taja's magician. Hamel looked up and found that the person who came through the portal was no one else. It was none other than King Kamar Taj, another great magician. However, Wang has changed somewhat compared to before. The original me looked very strong, even a little fat. After practicing Lias Haoyan shattering fist for such a long time, his figure has lost a lot of weight. Under the robe, there are all strong muscles, and a lot of the flesh on the face has also disappeared. This made the king, who originally looked very fierce, look even more fierce. Fortunately, everyone knows that Wang is a gentle man. Hamel was a little surprised to see Wang enter the mirror dimension from the outside world. King, why did you enter the mirror dimension? Wang was also a little surprised when he heard this. I should be the one to ask you, why are you here? You actually ran out of the pile of books. And who is this kid? The expression on Hamel's face was somewhat subtle. He looked at Qian He and hesitated for a long time before asking. Oh, by the way, what's your name, kid? Qian He. Fortunately, he was also a Kamar Taj magician and had heard rumors about Hamel to some extent, so he spoke helplessly. The great magician, my name is Qian He, and I am the magician who looks after the green plants. Oh okay, I know. Hamel nodded. Then he asked Wang. This is a little magician, nothing special, why are you here? Wang was a little speechless. I've been here all the time lately. Kamar Taj cannot find such a good training location as the mirror dimension. Wang shook his head and said. As he practiced, his power became stronger and stronger. Training among Kamar Taj is too destructive. If not careful, the entire Kamar Taj could be destroyed. Wang has been practicing in the mirror dimension recently for a long time. To him, this was nothing surprising. It's worth wondering. Hamel actually showed up here. You must know that this veteran magician rarely goes out. He spends most of his time in a pile of papers and magic books and seldom comes out. Did you actually see him in the mirror dimension this time? What's happening here? The king was very puzzled. Naturally, Hamel didn't know the king's doubts. He just suddenly realized. I see. It seems that the rumor that you received the inheritance of the magic book is also true. The strength has increased so much. Ordinary magicians do not need to be trained in the mirror space. It seems that Wang has already made some great progress to be like this. It seems that he has really done a lot of things during this time. Hamel thought in his mind. Wang was noncommittal and said nothing more. The reason I'm here is simply to train. What are you doing here? And you brought this kid with you? Wang asked curiously. Definitely here to experiment. I'm much more cautious than you. I never do experiments outside. Hamel said with a smile. Is that because the Sorcerer Supreme won't let you experiment with magic inside Kamar Taj? My recollection is that you almost destroyed half of Kamar Taj. Wong complained without hesitation. Hamel's fairy-like temperament suddenly became unbearable, with a slightly embarrassed look on his face. That's not important, what's important is this kid. Like you, he has inherited the magic book and has mysterious power. And this mysterious power is very powerful. Hamel changed the subject and spoke in a rather serious tone. Oh, a being who has obtained the knowledge of the magic book appears again. It's really incredible. Wang's eyes also lit up. What power did you gain? How's the combat effectiveness? Is it also a special power? Wang asked hurriedly. Compared to old scholars like Hamel, Wang does not have such in-depth research on the nature of power. What he cares about most is combat effectiveness. For him, becoming an official magician gives him a powerful fighting ability. Kamar Taj is ultimately a force born to protect the earth. Their most important task is to fight against all kinds of evil beings. Naturally, the strength of a magician becomes the standard for measuring the value of a magician. This is a dangerous world after all. I don't know about the great magician. Qian He smiled bitterly. Where had he come into contact with the two great magicians before? 
I'm still a little nervous now. I could only stutter and answer. It's normal. You were just an ordinary magician before. It's very normal to have no awareness of one's own strength. But don't worry, you just need to experiment and you will know. Well, let me try a few moves on you to see how strong you are. Wang said with a serious face. Wang suddenly felt that it was a good opportunity. Even an unreliable and lazy guy like Bono can become so powerful with the power given by the magic book. Maybe Kion can create a strong figure for Kamartaj again this time. Therefore, he was very attentive to this guidance. And Qian he over there looked weird. The big magician wants to fight him. Isn't he in big trouble? Hamel next to him also rolled his eyes. Among the old-looking magicians around him, no one was as old-fashioned as his age. You really burn the harp and boil the crane. You don't understand what elegance is. We should study the principles behind this thing. It's not just for fighting. The little old man Hamel was blowing his beard and staring, very dissatisfied with the king's behavior. Hamel magician, we don't have this condition. Wong said calmly. Completely ignoring Hamel's words, Kion was just a little magician before he got mudden. He is also considered a marginal figure in Kamar Taj. After discovering that he does not have that powerful magic ability, he gave up practicing magic and lay down. Instead, I learned a lot about how to care for various plants. Even in human society, he would probably be able to find a suitable job. It can be seen how far this little guy has become partial to science. Now that the king wanted to give him some advice, he was naturally very nervous. How long has it been since he obtained wood escape? He has never used many of the ninjutsu recorded in Mujutsu, and his combat effectiveness cannot be said to be strong. Magician, are you thinking about it again? How can I be your opponent? Qian he said with a wry smile. You kid, you think too much. How could I let you fight me head on? If I stand here and don't move, I'm afraid you won't be able to hurt me even a hair. Wang's stiff face couldn't help but reveal a smile. Even if you have obtained the power of the magic book, there is still a distinction between superior and inferior. For most magicians, the power they have just gained is not that powerful and requires a long period of training. Not to mention the little magician in front of me. Even if Bono gained strength and practiced for a long time, he probably wouldn't be able to hurt the king even a hair. His body has reached a strength that is unimaginable to ordinary people. But, for Qian He, this is a bit unbelievable. Are you kidding me? The wood escape attack is very powerful. No worse than magic. Qian He looked puzzled by this behavior. A smile appeared on Wang's face again. This little magician is so ignorant. The more ignorant a person is, the more confident he is. They have never seen it before. This world is so vast and incredible. Before obtaining the power of the magic book, it was hard for the king to imagine that one day his physical strength would reach this level. The magic book not only gave him power, but also greatly increased his knowledge. Do not believe, young people, it's good to have confidence. That's it, I'll stand here and you attack me with all your strength. If I move, I lose, Wong said with great confidence. Before Qian he could speak, Hamel spoke first. Having never seen Wang's abilities, he instinctively questioned. Isn't it a bit risky for Wang to do this? You have to know, this is a very dangerous thing. Even the body of a great magician has its limits. I don't think your body can be much harder than the iron wood in the library. Hamel frowned and spoke. The magic of Kamar Taj is wonderful. As they practice magic, there is always magical energy absorbed by their bodies. This also greatly increases their physical fitness, making them much stronger than ordinary humans. Otherwise, it will not be able to withstand various powerful impacts. However, this kind of power also has limits. The physical fitness of most magicians is probably not comparable to the extremely hard wooden pillars in the library. He had seen the traces caused by this boy's magic. Can Wang's body withstand such an attack? Hamel, don't underestimate me. During this period, I have not been idle. I am much stronger than before. I just look stupid, but I'm not stupid. After comforting Hamel, Wong looked at Qian He. Boy, there's no need to hold back, just try your best to take action. Let me see what the power you have learned from the magic book is like. Qian He was stunned and swallowed. He is actually a very peaceful person. What I usually like most is getting along with various plants. 
He had never heard Wang behave like this in his life. But as a person selected by the magic book, money and nature are also unusual. He is very decisive. Now that Wang has asked, Qian he no longer hesitates. In that case, that's offending, big magician. Money and money. Instead, Wang glanced at him approvingly. No need to be polite, just take action. Better use your full strength and let me see. Being able to test a new power is a rare opportunity for magicians. Yes, big magician. Qian he nodded heavily. He first took two steps back, and then began to mobilize the chakra in his body. Chakra is the power derived from the essence of life and Kamartaj magician mobilizes the magic of the universe. There is the most essential difference. It is somewhat similar to the most traditional magician. Money and letting the power of chakra flow through the body. The next moment, his hands moved quickly. Various strange handprints appeared in his hands, and complex energy fluctuations began to surround him. Wood release. Thorn killing technique. Qian he shouted, the seal in his hand had reached the final step. His gesture completed and the ground began to shake. In order to perform well, he tried his best this time. As the ground shook, four square pillars as thick as a bowl emerged from the ground. This thing is like a treated square piece of wood, which looks ordinary. But compared to ordinary wood, this thing seems to be alive. The four pieces of wood seemed like living snakes from the beginning, wrapping around the king. And with Qian He's control, the wood was constantly twisting and growing, directly wrapping around Wang's body, wrapping him tightly. Interesting. Not only did Wang have no intention of resisting, but he looked at the trees surrounding him with interest. The spiritual power penetrated into it to observe its structure. At this time, the trees that had not moved at first suddenly tightened. It's like a real python strangling its prey. These trees were constantly squirming like living creatures, trying to strangle the king. Gaba, Gaba, the sound of bones even came from the king's body. Feeling the huge power coming from around his body, Wang's eyes flashed with surprise. This kind of power is so strong. Even an ordinary magician would be strangled instantly if entangled by this thing. But with the strength of the great magician, such a thing would never happen. Even so, this power is surprising enough. It was hard for him to imagine that trees could possess such huge power. The magic book is indeed incredible. It is simply turning decay into magic. In the space, Lin Yu, who was paying attention to all this, couldn't help but sigh. Wood escape is really amazing. This fully unleashes the original power of plants. In fact, the power of plants is immense. A small blade of grass can even cause cracks in stones and shapeshifting in asphalt pavement. After the seeds break out of their shells, they can even break through steel. Wood escape is to maximize the power of plants. The power that burst out instantly was stronger than magic. The system can completely restore the given wood release, which is really amazing. I hope everyone will support it and subscribe more.